DTP, we got them guns that go Yeah, I'm all about the pistol play A cold-blooded killer Niggas recognize my name I dub the young killer You better tell your man that with the gauges I'm nice I'll shoot up y'all white shirts until y'all look like dice But I'm through with all the talking Time to show on you niggas I too old, I'm like J-Lo Going through niggas DTP, we ain't playing If you try to get our band AKs get the spraying like Bottom line, that mean I'm bout it Any nigga wanna doubt it Bust you in the broad day On a street that's fully crowded Find a hole inside your chest Just for thinking it's rap And tell that pretty bitch thug We got some pretty big cats Shot can say I'm shot out And I tend to agree So you should watch what you're saying If it's intended for me So be careful what you start And let my fingers do the walking And that oozy get the talking like Is you a G or what? Now it's just me and my nuts. That's all I got in this world. I'm pulling pistols out my stomach and throwing them bitches up like Earl. Serving the club headshots. Got a covered run scram. I'm 38 hot with a pearl handle. And I'm throwing texts like an NBA ref. I got all gold guns like they came from Iraq. Artillery, could it be? I got all kinds of these pistols. I point my gun at your homeboy. Make your own folks hit you. And ain't taking no more pictures if you snap. I'm a click anyway, plus I got bullets in the clip the size of Lil' Fate And I'm webbing choppers like helicopters, you gon' need hella doctors when the Glock go Stay on the set, bitch, better watch your lip, that text bit quick 20 over there, titty over there, loot over there, ain't no exit trick Us you don't mess with, we got them guns like action flicks Reload with the next clip, I'm the wrong nigga to flex with, bitch Come on and test this, my gun I'm having sex with, shit Put a bullet in, shoot it out, got them long horns like Texas, bitch Look at my necklace, make me hit a nigga disrespect this click My pistol rip sound like this Like Sylvester Stallone So therefore you should invest In a vest for your dome Cause I know you marks Planning on getting me When I'm landing Used to nick But my cannon go Fuck a medic We gon' call your ass a taxi cab Bleeding so hard You'll need a life-size maxi pad So flip the script And tell your woman It's your time of the month AK-47 for the niggas Who really looking for heaven And a nine for you chump Got killers in my squad And I'm the nicest one in my group But I got bananas for you niggas And I ain't talking about fruit I'll peel your cab back With the black back Till your back crack Cock the gat back like Back, back, back Swallow a hollow Make them digest with the 50 caliber Your future's not Looking so good, tomorrow's not on your calendar I do away with the amateurs, they breathing too long I leave them coughing like the sound effects you hear in this song My shotguns are cold and hard, but my desert is easy And my triggers are always talking about some squeeze me, squeeze me And buddy's fakers talking greasy, I'm starting to show My Uzi got a drum roll, it goes uh, yeah. Boulevard, G-Roll, East Road
take another's life, so I peep. Checking the scene, but staying low, so I'm not seen. Case I gotta get away, gotta make this shit clean, G. So I'm looking for a victim. Gotta be right, took my time and I picked them. Scope shit, then I licked them. Now I'm back in the news, no clues, but yet another murder. You should've heard the nigga squeal when I stuck his ass. I had to grin, cause it's funny, nigga, fuck, fuck his ass. ass. He ain't the last, and surely ain't the first G. But his monkey ass roll away in a hearse, G. So I'm feeling somewhat relieved. Just another day in the life of the easy. A real G, so forget that silly shit you heard. It's do or die, easy E gets the last word. Cause it's the end of the world, and still niggas ain't got no satisfaction. So I take my nine, put it on my sin, put the cop in his head, now I'm blasting. Cause I'm known as a G, and I'm coming from the CPT. And you should know, bitch ass niggas from the backs can't fuck with me. What is up, guys? It's your boy, Attica from the Attica World Network here. Let me let me pause donations real quick before we start. Anyways, guys, thank you for joining me tonight. Sorry that the stream had such a late start to it. I usually don't pop, but I had to apologize for that because I usually would start a little bit earlier. I'm fucking up my own sleep schedule. <clears throat> I'm fucking my own shit up tonight because I usually sleep at around like 12, but I figured I wanted to um, start later because I got home and my schedule was kind of fucked up and you know, I'm preparing for this trip to LA that I'm taking in a few days for TwitchCon and I know for a fact that there's certain things I have to solidify for that, but I don't want to say them on stream because I know a couple of the people that I'm going to be surprising with said things are not anticipating it, so I'm going to try my best to not spill the beans. I know as the night goes on and energy rises, I'm most likely going to have to like crack, but I mean, you know what, I want to keep everything as low key as I can for this TwitchCon thing. I'm looking it's going to be hype as hell. Bro, if you're going to TwitchCon, there's there's a real good chance that you're going to get fucked up with your boy, all right? I, I, I my voice is a little bit messed up right now, man. I don't know what the hell did I do to get my voice fucked. I mean, I didn't really do like well, maybe the last stream I was screaming too much, maybe that's why. Or maybe I just hadn't said anything all day, so I'm a little bit of horse around horse around the throat. But yo, boys, what is up? Y'all are good in the chat? How are my niggas doing tonight? Are y'all ready to have some fun are y'all ready to go in are you ready to chill with me the thing is i'm gonna be in la for like two weeks and by the way shout out to nintendo guru coming through heavy duty 20 dollars donation right off top big numbers in here that nigga he's sending me what is this a mouse emote talking about let's get some mouse emojis going for what reason do we have these it's almost time my boy one last thing before the irl Chuck E. cheese stream what the fuck are you dead ass Nick, this nigga's been obsessed with this shit lately. Have you guys seen? I don't know what this man's problem is, but he's he he's insisting that I go to a Chuck E. Cheese in my area and interact with the shit there. Like I I that's definitely not on my list of things to do, bro. It it probably never will be. You need to start giving up. You've donated over a hundred dollars now, telling me to go to Chuck E. Cheese. Can somebody tell this nigga that I won't do it? Anyways, thanks a lot for the donation, man. How are you guys doing, bro? Let me read that. Ah, everybody, I already know what y'all niggas are talking about. God damn it. Why does it feel like this saga is never ending, man? Motherfucking Rice Gum and iDubs. These two are going at it consistently. I mean, not only has iDubs made a follow up response to Rice Gum's response, but now I think Rice Gum made a follow up to iDubs follow up on Rice Gum's. <laughs> This shit is fucking ridiculous now, and to be real with you, I don't know, it's starting to lose its flavor a little bit, but I think today, just to put the final nail in the coffin, we're going to put it to rest, and we're going to see just what the hell the deal is, what kind of retaliation Rice Gum could have on iDub's response. I mean, the response of video that I, I heard, it was apparently really dope, and I got spoiled to a few things in it, because people were obviously screaming about certain cameos that popped in, but I mean... 
I do definitely want to check it out because, like I said, I care about both of these content creators. I'm curious to see how this turns. And on top of it all, um, I'm really... I don't think it's possible for Rice going to make a comeback with this thing, but if he actually does, I I'll, I want to be there to see that shit. I don't know. This is like such a crazy beef, man. I mean, these niggas have fucking influence, and this shit is back and forth, bro. Jesus Christ, niggas talking about content deputy. That's the name of that shit? God damn, bro. So I does came back to continue the slaughter. We had a donation coming in from Chief68 who said, so what kind of trouble are we getting ourselves into? I got a couple things stocked up, man. You know, the thing that's great about these late night streams is that obviously the mods are asleep, which means it's easy for us to do fucked up shit and not get caught. Although we've done it at like six in the, in the daytime or even like a 12. Then again, I haven't done anything fucking crazy at like morning or whatever. But late night is usually the best time for that shit. I mean, I can just do it in the stream, and as soon as the stream is done, delete that bitch. So that way YouTube can't strike me <laughs> over anything. No community guidelines in this bitch. The video don't exist. What What do you mean Etika did hard drugs in the stream? What do you mean Etika had gore on his stream? I don't remember those moments. <laughs> what are you talking about? Anyways, you know what I'm saying. Big T. That nigga Big T. Motherfucking Big T knows what I'm saying, bro. What's going on, brother? I haven't seen you in a little bit. Not too long. Yeah, I haven't seen you in like two or three streams. Maybe three or four streams. Not three streams, man. Well, how you been, man? Ah, boy, my niggas is in here. I see you all. The boys are here. Can I get a hold up in the chat, please? Just a hold up emote. We are out here. All my niggas. Let's go. Hold on a second. Content deputy. Yes, everybody, just shut the fuck up. I know. It's a content deputy. You don't have to repeat it over and over again, nigga. Let's go. Are we ready, though? All right. So, you know what? Just so I can satiate every... Satiate? So, so that's why I can satisfy everybody's need for this content deputy bullshit. We're gonna get this out the way early, all right? I don't want to hear you niggas talking about this shit for too much longer, dog. Like, God damn it, I'm getting tired of this shit. I mean, I know even though I, I guess it's brought about a lot of like newcomers to the channel because of all the highlight clips that have been posted, which I didn't even expect. I mean, some of these highlight clips are getting a lot of views, dog. I mean, what the fuck? Who the hell's watching? And to be honest with you, this shit's kind of crazy because I've been getting follows from a lot of people that I followed before as content creators that I didn't really. Know know me or whatever they following me back and shit it's like what the fuck it's crazy so you know what as a matter of fact dog just to be real want some real shit oh by the way um adrian fahrenheit tepez thank you for the spawns love man i appreciate it welcome to the green group sponsor benefits are in the description but dog i've been getting followed by some cool peeps lately man like hold on i gotta show y'all this shit because niggas niggas are out here bro like that's the thing that makes it so weird on this channel it's like the streams we do so much fucked up shit that it gets the attention of niggas that aren't usually in the gaming sphere or even in like you know nintendo related gaming that is for instance, if you go to my Twitter page, and you know what, this is one that's just personal because I'm a big fan of this person I'm about to show you, and recently they followed me, and it's kind of like, whoa, shit, they followed, that's so cool, so, hold on, I'm about to pull it up right now. Uh, I, I, I know you guys probably know this person already, but, um, you know Brittany Venti? She follows me now on Twitter, I mean, I'm such, I feel like such a fan, ah! It's so bad. Here's the thing, man. If you want to be friends with a content creator, never come at him like a fan. But I mean, I'm such a fan of Britney Vance. She's so fucking hilarious. And not to mention that she's nice in the eyeballs, too. So I mean, she actually followed me recently. I don't know if she found me through the content cop um, highlight clips that niggas have been posting or whatever. But I was, I'm pretty happy about that. I, I feel good. And not only that, but a certain other YouTuber followed me, too. And I ain't going to reveal that one yet. I'll do that one later on in the stream. I'll show y'all niggas that shit because it's a little bit more on the controversial side, if you know what I mean. But I mean, you know, you know. But, but this is a fucking. This channel is all about controversy at the end of the day, so I mean, hey, fuck it. Every night we do some fucked up, well, not every night, but, you know, every other night. Well, every every month we do something fucked up, okay? <laughs> Purple old Bushido, thank you for the spawns, love, my doy. My, my, my doy, my boy. Really do appreciate that. Sponsors coming in here by the bucket load. You niggas might see somewhat of a weird emote in the list. Just ignore it. It doesn't mean anything, and it has no pertinence to the stuff that we're going to be doing tonight, of course. Anyways, so let us continue. We got content deputy. Well, wait a minute. Before we begin, let me get a... I didn't see the hold up from before. Can I get that hold up again? I hadn't seen it before. What are you boys doing out here? Are you even watching the stream? Are you even alive right now? Are you Are you, Are you? you willing to go? Are you willing to go in with me tonight, or are you going to be a lazy bitch? Are you going to be sleepy as fuck, or are you actually going to have some energy in you? I got energy. Nigga, it's past my bedtime, and I'm still ready to get into some trouble what the fuck are you niggas doing with your lives man y'all boys are the ones that are lacking y'all are the ones that are lacking bro i don't know what the hell's wrong with these boys um kyh9 he seems like he's ready he says how was your credit meeting shit went well can't complain um it's a process and it involves a little bit of money but hey 
spend now, credit better later, I don't have to worry about bullshit. Um, it'll help me to get an even better apartment later on. He says also, Evil Within 2 is live. Do you want a copy? That's the that's a really popular game um, that came out like maybe two years ago, and it was like movie style, with all this crazy horror shit going on. I remember that one. Um, I didn't really get to play it too much, but I don't know if I'll even get a chance to play the second one. There's a lot of shit going on this month. But thank you for the offer, though, man. He says, if you say yes on stream, I'll, so I'll try to send it to your Gmail. Thank you very much, KY. But don't worry about it, bro. Um, if anything, you don't have to spend the extra money on me. I, I, I mean, I, I could buy it if it really was that much of an interest, but I'm not sure if niggas want to see me play it. And plus, I'm really not sure if I'll have the time because there's so much shit going on. Art Dodger is back in here. Heavy duty nigga. He's ready to go in. Y'all niggas are ready to play. It's time to play the game, my boys. Art Dodger saying, Nigga, there was some fucking idiot who sold his car for Suzuki one sauce? No fucking way. Maybe it was like a joke article. Are you reading like the fake news shit that niggas be always talking about on Twitter? Bro, there's no way in hell that you're telling me a grown man sold his automobile used to travel to and from work for a pack of sauce from McDonald's. Thanks to a Rick and Morty meme popularization. I, I refuse to believe that shit. But anyways, um, Art, really do appreciate the 50. I just don't appreciate the fucking bullshit that you attached to that, man. Like, if you're going to tell me about these crazy things, make sure that they're actually legit. Because that one definitely ain't. Suzuki and sauce. <laughs> Niggas are acting like they're you're not, you're not surprised? What the fuck? This sauce must be some... This sauce must have, like, every single drug in the world maximized to 100 condensed to the size of a McDonald's packet. Like, what the fuck? It's re- nah, nah, I refuse to believe that. You niggas are bullshitting me. You always bullshit me, though. That's nothing new. Motherfuckers have the same reoccurring theme. You always try to fucking dupe Etika the most. How- who can- who can bamboozle the nigga? What am I, a fucking circus act to you? Do I have- do I have any existence to you as a human being with thoughts, emotions, dreams, hopes, ambitions, and sentience? Or am I just a fucking- a, a monkey that can- that can do tricks and stand on his motherfucking head and shake his ass on camera? Was that what I am? I thought I meant more to you. Motherfucking- this motherfucker thinks I'm a fool. I ain't no fool, all right? I may act a fool, but that doesn't mean I am a fool, all right? Shuji Atacha coming through with $35. Thank you for that Red Robin love right there. It's always nice to put my eyes on the waifu. He says, chill stream today? Awesome. Uh, keep doing what you do. Um, wait, he says, as always, keep doing what you do best, Attica Shuji, my friend. It's niggas like you that keep the blood pumping in this bitch. The same blood that was dripping from my lip when I cut that shit. But it actually healed up pretty well. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I'm pretty much okay. I thought it was going to leave a long scar down the middle of my chin, which would have been badass because, you know, girls, girls love fucking scars. Bitches love scars. But I mean, it didn't, so whatever. I was thinking about just doing it myself. <laughs> But nah, I don't think I'll do that. Uh, I ain't no motherfucking emo ass nigga, all right? This ain't 2006, dog. I ain't no scene kid. Shit. <laughs> Can you be a scene nigga with a high top fade? I don't know. I don't think so, bro. Um, the new ABO, T68 with the spawns up. What's going on, nigga? Content deputy? All right, so let's see here. We have some things to look at. Content deputy niggas are going on and on about this shit. Wait, this is actually a good song. Wait, let me turn this shit up. This one, this, this, shit is, this shit is real. Trinidad Jane Cole, Westside, Bank Heat. I think the name of this song is, uh, Fuck That Bitch. It doesn't apply to me, but I remember when I was in a relationship way before Christine, and, and this is the song, this is the wave. Fuck That Bitch. Ah, that shit was hard. That shit goes hard, man. Weed em, wait. Hold on, we have a nigga named Weed em Boys. Coming through with the spawns love. What's going up, bro? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Smash all this is also in here. A lot of donations. Oh, God. This is you. Why do I, I? You know what? To this day, I'll never, ever not be surprised at it. I mean, it happens every single time I stream, but it's like, God damn. Don't you niggas ever run out of money to give? Am I really the source of all your funds? I swear, some of you motherfuckers don't have anything else to do but to sit there and spend your fucking money on me. That's some scary shit. You know what's crazy, though? Your boy hasn't gotten a single charge back in the past, like, three, four five weeks it's been crazy no one's charged me back anything including that nigga rakti do you remember that dude he came through to the stream one time and in a single session donated like two grand to me it was ridiculous and remember we pulled him up on the phone i called the nigga on stream i was like yo i don't know what happened here do you guys remember that shit I don't mean to sound offensive to him as an individual, you know, it's, it's insanely generous what he did, <coughs> but he sounded a little odd on, ca <coughs> on camera when he was in the call with me, because <coughs> it made it seem like 
there was something fucked up that was gonna happen. So trust me, my asshole was puckered to the size of a of a of a dot, ready for that ramming of that PayPal chargeback. But just to let you guys know, Rack D7 is a legend. He never charged me back or anything like that. It's insane. So big shout out to um him and big shout out to all the other niggas that came through. Are we ready to watch this content deputy? Man, I and these shits constantly going back and forth. And I know Ricecom has a response to that. So, he's he going to bury himself? Tell me this. In your opinion, before we watch this thing, did Ricecom bury himself deeper in the ground than before? Or was he actually able to claw his way out of his fucking funeral pyre a little bit? How did it go in your book? Captain Slapnut. I saw um, I saw Smashologist before you, too. He says, stopped my weed marathon to watch my boy. Can I get a Joy-Con, boys? Sure you can, bro. You got that hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I want to know if that nigga rice gum buried himself is, is it really over for this boy i'm pulling it up right now i'm going right to the browser fuck this no more delaying bro no more delaying it's time to get the business uh i do twitter I, i'll just go to his twitter and then go to his fucking youtube page whatever yeah, everyone's saying that he got buried. Niggas are saying Post Malone was in this content deputy thing. I wish you dudes knew how to keep a secret. That would have been cool to see a reaction to. But the original content cop on this nigga, <laughs> Jake Paul, got 18 million views. And this was co-signed by YouTube. The title, used, the title got the video taken down when it was first posted. And then YouTube said, you know what? He fucked him in the ass so well that we want this to be seen by everyone. 18 million. Who the fuck watched this? I mean, he only has 5 million subscribers. The fact that, well, I guess I, uh, Riot Scum's audience watched it. Um, iDubs watched it. So that's like 10 million. And then just other random stragglers from random places on the internet watched this shit too. It was an absolutely view-generating drama. I mean, the views and all that other stuff wasn't the focus, but the shit was crazy. Smash all just, and Gimme. Wait, what? Who the fuck is this? <clears throat> Grimmy is... Grimmy Island? Wait. Grimmy... Is th that heard? Grim Grimmels the third. Grimmels the third. All right, you, you, you got to put an underscore in your name somewhere, bro. I could barely read that shit. He says, "What is good, my boy?" Hold on a second. We had Lil Chu who donated as well. Sorry about that, man. I'm, we're about to watch this nigga's video real quick, but hold on, Grim. I'm gonna call you Grim from now on. All right, bro. That's gonna have to work. Cause I mean, fuck, fuck, fuck all that other shit. <laughs> fuck all the other shit in your name. Everybody gets the same treatment here. I don't give a fuck what kind of nice name you got, nigga. I'm only reading the first few syllables. That's it. I can't even find the shit here. With a $69 donation, he's ready to have sex in this bitch. What is going on, man? It's my first time donating. Yes, it is. That name. Whenever somebody has a new fucking tongue twister in this bitch, it always, it, it, it always remains in my memory, man. But I remember you from now on. Just make sure you shorten that bitch to grim. He says I've been around since the AOT days. But anyways, I recently drew Kamui and Robin. And I hope to God that this is not, you know, some sex type shit. Even if it is YouTube. I mean, I'm not out here trying to show niggas pornography on the stream. I mean, that's not the intention. It's whatever. If it's some porn, it's some porn. You know what? As a matter of fact, I'm a fucking man. I got balls, nigga. Let's fucking go. Let's see. Is this porn, bro? Grim, I'm about to check this out right now. Is this porn? Oh, it's not porn. Oh, okay. I was almost hoping it was porn. But I mean, it's actually pretty good artwork. This nigga did a good job here. Wait, this shit is actually kind of clean, bro. What the fuck? Oh, shit. All right. I see you out here, Grim. You're doing work. I see you, boy. I think that's like the Grandmaster costume for Robin. Very, very nice stuff here. You got the Kamui on deck. Yes, this gets a like from me, nigga, without a doubt. Keep it up, bro. You got the right waifus in mind. You can't go wrong. You cannot go wrong with your boy if you show me some of these Fire Emblem waifu, all right? I'm, I'm, I'm telling you that right now, but you niggas already knew. We them boys, after all. Can I get a hold up? Man, let's fucking go. We ready to go in tonight. Um, a nigga. Oh, and I have um Shuji who came through earlier. I didn't get to read yours yet. And Captain Who? Who the fuck? All these niggas came through. Shuji says, um, chill stream today. As always, keep doing what you do, Etika. Thank you very much, Shuji. Did I actually read yours? I feel like I read yours. And Art Dodgic said, nigga, there's some fucking idiot who sold his car for scissor winch. Oh, I'm, I'm never going to be able to read that shit. And thank you. Thank you. I, okay, so I read those already. And this one's coming from downgrading. Why are these going so fast? Why are you donating so fast? This is a problem. Stop donating so much. Your niggas are overwhelming me. 
because <laughs> I appreciate your money, of course. But goddamn, a nigga can't breathe. Um, thank you very much, though. I, I'm all, I'm joking around, of course. I'm down, downgrading low bros, low blows. If you niggas are gonna be sending me donations now, I almost want to start a criteria. Don't send me shit unless you got something fucked up to say. I want to see something fucked up, a, a link to something that's gonna throw the stream off. Okay, I got my own ideas of how to fuck niggas up tonight. But I mean, any contributions from this point forward, at least now you know. If there's something that's crazy, like you remember the gauntlet or the 50/50, as disgusting as those things were, I'll try my best to censor them if they are like actually really explicitive but i mean come come at me come at me i'm ready for it i think the stream can handle it too boys we didn't get to these numbers we didn't get to this stance on youtube gaming or develop this following by being bitch niggas did we are we bitch niggas or are we real niggas you tell me because i don't know sometimes the stream content be shifting i got a lot of new heads in here new subscribers on the daily coming in by the thousands i don't know you niggas you some of you see my oh, oh i like them here subscribe i don't fucking know you nigga who the fuck is you are you a bitch nigga are you a, are, are you a snitch nigga i hope not because that's the criteria over here. One thing you have to understand here, the reason why these streams be so elusive, oh, how can I catch Etika's stream? I never know when it happens. Is there a schedule? <laughs> how do I tune in? Bitch, nigga, you, the, real, the reason why you can't find a schedule, you don't know when to tune in, is because this shit ain't for everyone, all right? This shit ain't rated E. This shit ain't rated T. This shit ain't rated M. This shit is rated adults only, boy. I got motherfucking 12 year olds in this bitch that act more adult than motherfuckers out here that are 30. I got some savages in this bitch. I don't know if you're ready, but one thing I'll tell you, if your bitch ass can't take the heat, then get the fuck out my kitchen. This is my kitchen, boy. If you can't cook, you can't keep... Whew, damn, this shit is spicy. Get the fuck out. This ain't made for you. This is a real nigga stream. No bitch niggas. No bitch niggas. And Jabari, he knows that rule better than almost anyone. What's going on, man? He says, I got the night off work. He's working right now. Wait, no, he's not working. Oh, he said night off. Sipping on Crown and just streaming, we definitely getting in trouble tonight, boy. I already know you already know Zavari. I already know I missed like a million donations before you, but boy, it's about to go down. I hope that sets the mood, sets the tone, so you dudes know exactly what the situation is here. All right, niggas be thinking, oh yeah, you know, can't wait to have some fun with Etika. There's nothing fun about these streams. <laughs> There's no fun to be had. This isn't a cupcake walk through the valley of chocolate and gummy bears. This is motherfucking savagery tonight. The chill stream? I'm about to give up on the concept of a chill stream. This shit's about to get lit, nigga. Lit, nigga, for the real shit. <laughs> this is getting too real. I'm scaring myself. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm scaring the shit out of myself. All right, content deputy. So we have the shit loaded up right here. I'm about to open it up in a new tab. There we go. I'm going to pause it real quick because I, there's still donations that are coming in. You boys are still bombarding me right now. My key saying I've got work tomorrow morning. Oh, yeah. And on top of it all, what makes this some real shit is that niggas always have things to do in the a.m. Therefore, you're going to completely destroy yourself if you stay here any longer. Are you willing to make that sacrifice to sacrifice your sanity, well-being and efficiency in the morning for the sole purpose of getting lit with your boy tonight? I don't know what the hell the situation is here, but damn, I'm hyping myself up right now. This is getting real as fuck. I hope to God you boys are ready. My keys, we have a long night, by the way. A long night prepared. Let's just say, boys, I got some shit planned. You might want to stay in your seat. Who knows? You may just win something. <laughs> Sponsors might know what I'm talking about. Anyways, how much winking can your boy do? Um, Mikey's, thank you very much. He says, you better make sure the stream title holds true. What is the stream title? I actually forgot. Trouble tonight with Etik. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, that's going to hold up, yeah. That, that's definitely relevant in this situation. Yeah, I, I, some, I, I'll be forgetting this shit sometimes. My keys, thank you. Um, We also had, oh my God, a lot of donations. Hold on a minute. Hold on a motherfucking minute. My key, oh my fucking God, a lot of niggas are out here. Jesus Christ. Okay, we, we got the video loaded up though. Don't worry, we're about to watch it. We got it, I got it right here. I'm going to make sure I keep this thing open so niggas know when they come in the stream. Yes, we're about to watch this content deputy and see what the hell the deal is. Um, Lil Chu says, Etika is about to break the limits. <laughs> 
<laughs> my cloud shit. Sing go go Kaido. Let's go. Um, but I like that. You always keep streams hyped, except on Cuphead when you couldn't beat the genie. Fuck you. <laughs> A little too goddamn it. Why did you have to bring that up now? It's not the time or the place. We're supposed to be wilding out tonight. Not bringing up my failures and losses in the past. This isn't a stream meant for L's. This is the one meant for wilding. W's. W means wilding, nigga. Let's fucking go. Are y'all out here? EJ Lennon, goddamn it, man. <laughs> Stop spoiling the surprise, EJ. Anyways, are we out here, little too? I appreciate the Minecraft creepers in the background. You know why? Because this bitch is about to blow up, nigga. It's about to blow up. Are we ready? This is about to be like a motherfucking Minecraft scene. You just built a house and a fucking creeper walks in that bitch and he does that bitch down to the ground. Let's go. Our Dodger is in here too. He says, this is the article. Oh, God. It was actually real. I know, niggas saying I'm stalling. I'm not stalling. I'm not intentionally stalling. I'm just trying to make sure I have everything in check. But these motherfuckers, these motherfuckers are coming crazy right now. Our Dodger, our Dodger, where you at? Okay, I see your article right here, bro. I'm going to click that because I'm definitely... This is a Time article? A Time Magazine article. You mean it's a... The video Clavier was not found. Whatever. A zealous Rick and Morty fan traded his car for a precious pack of Suzuchuin sauce. Oh, what the? So this is actually legit. You know what? Maybe in the year 2010, this would truly surprise me. But 2017, after 16 especially, just brings on way too much wild shit. I mean, Donald Trump's president. So that completely just downgrades my surprise factor on anything that could be like considered outrageous news. I mean, it's real. I, I, I got to be honest there. So, I mean... As crazy as this is, if it's a shitty car though, it's a it's a Volkswagen 2000s. Isn't that bitch worth like two grand? Still, why would you? So he gave a nigga his keys for a packet of sauce. All right, all right, bro. You know, let the nigga rock. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna judge him, man. You know, we live in we live in the politically correct era. All right, as unpolitically correct as we are over here, because we say fuck everybody. I mean, it, at the same time. I won't judge a man for, actually, yeah, here, I will fuck that, he's a fucking moron, who in the hell, how good is this sauce, I'm curious now though, Chief 68 with the spawns love, thank you very much Chief, and um, hold on, hold on, hold on, okay, so we had Lil Chu, our Dodgic, thank you for that stupid ass article, Lil Chu, uh, my keys, Jabari, yo, once again, props to Jabari for that huge donation, I'm glad to hear that my man is chilling tonight, he ain't working hard, he's just watching his boy, downgrading low blows, I caught you, a nigga, a grimmy, Grim, Grim the Third or whatever. Um, yeah, Grim the Third. There we go. But Grim, I'm calling you Grim. Um, Captain Slapnut. I see yours. Um, Stop my weed marathon. Smashologist. I saw yours. And um, yep, yeah, I think we got them all. Fuji. Smashologist says, long time no see. I'm always lurking and supporting in the shadows. By the way, did you make it to your meeting? Um, I, I talked about that earlier, right? How my meeting went. It was okay. I mean, um, it's going to take a little while to fix that credit shit. But you know what? At least it's going down. You know, I can't complain too much. All right. I think we're ready to start this thing. I think we're finally ready to start this thing. Uh, wait, let me see here. Lunar Wing Cloud. Who, wait, where is this nigga? Lunar Wing Cloud. How far back do these bitches go? How far back do we... Oh my god. These fucking things go far. EJ Lennon is in here with a $69 donation. That motherfucker is the psychopath of the stream. Yeah, you know what, EJ? You're the stream psycho from now on. I'm gonna call you that because sometimes, dude... I mean, you're a cool guy and all that, but sometimes you be scaring the shit out of me, EJ. I gotta be real with you, nigga. You be scaring the fuck out of me. He says, Kahoot hype, boys. I saw Kingsman 2 tonight. That movie was fucking amazing. Bring back the suck. You see, I don't even know. I haven't seen Kingsman 1. I think that's a, like a really critically acclaimed movie or something, but I haven't seen the shit yet. Um, EJ, thank you for the donation, though. I don't know what you're talking about. What the hell is a Kahoot? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> I don't know what the hell you mean, bro. That makes no sense to me. Uh, but thank you for the love, though, man. We are out here. Uh, my boy came through with the 69. He's out here representing for the waifu. You know what I'm about to do? I'm about to represent for my man, I dupes right now. We are about to watch this content. Whoa, deputy. So this is the response to Ricegum's response to iDub's content cop. All right? Headphones in. Are y'all niggas locked in? I'm ready to go. Open up my fro. <sighs> I don't fuck with no hoes. Okay, yeah, let's go. EJ, thank you once again, man. Um, you know, it's all in good fun. I didn't, I didn't mean that in a serious way, but actually, no, I didn't. You're scary, EJ. <laughs> I think this nigga is going to snap one day, and he's just going to ban everybody in the chat. He's going to do some wild shit like that. Um, all right, here we go. I got my volume. Let me know if the volume levels are good. Go back, back, so we're going back, 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 back again. Back, back content so i guess this is like a follow-up so what did rice gum say in his response that triggered idubs to the point where he felt like just hitting the nigga again that's all it feels like he just wants to call him out on his bullshit nigga making a sandwich though 
<laughs> that should look actually kind of good. No nuts acts involved. Never mind. What kind of cheese is that? Oh, uh, yeah. uh, mayo? Okay, that's it. I'm done. This is fucking disgusting. Eat those! What are you doing? Yeah. Oh, God. Nigga got raw footage. That shit must have been so awkward to do. Why is a nigga holding a big ass bottle of liquor? Actual, actual dime, thank you. How you doing, Attica? Looking forward to seeing Mayhem. Also, have you seen I Had in Time? Super cute. I've heard a lot about that game. It looks good. I just, you know, don't feel any need to play it, but. I guess this is like afterwards. Okay, and this is only 13 minutes, so it's not like 30, like the content cop was. What the fuck? Oh shit, niggas actually dragged his body? Damn. I'd always be going. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode. How does it go above and beyond for these shots? Deputy. I, I didn't know if I was going to have to make this video or not. Is this shit uh, too loud? Is, is, is he too loud and I'm too soft? Or <laughs> or is it everything good? Let me just make sure. Good. Is it good, Kamui? Sky's in here saying $20. Shut the fuck up, you stalling nigger. Well, joke's on you, Sky. Your donation was so backed up by all the other motherfuckers that are in here that yours didn't pop up until, you know. I was already watching it, so it doesn't apply in this. Therefore, do you feel stupid now? Your donation message is completely irrelevant. Within minutes of you doing it. Ha! Fuckers that are in here that okay, yours didn't okay. pop up. <laughs> Do any need to play it. But afterwards, okay, let me see here. Let me make sure my volume's good. Hear that. You're, uh, you know, testing audio over here is a constant thing. Actually dragged his body? Uh, Hello, everybody, and okay. welcome back volume, to volume. another episode. How does it go in above and beyond for these shots? Deputy. I, okay, I, I, didn't know if I, I think it's okay. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, back to the business. Let's go. Turns out, I, I don't have Thank to. you, those guys. I, I recorded some footage in anticipation of taking a massive L, but uh, it was a big W. That being Whoa. said, I'm going to go through the video point by point. I do I wonder. I want to ask I, him, in his own opinion, what Rice Gum could have said that would have gotten him the W. Recorded some footage in anticipation of taking a massive L, hmm. but uh, it was a big W. That hmm. being said, I'm going to go through the video point by point and just sort Good. of give my take on it. In the video, he portrays me as uh -oh. like this money hunter. The breakdown. I only care about money. I only care about Blockhead. myself. No. What is up, Blockhead, man? He says, yo, talking about the Suzuchuin sauce, next time we see you, we're giving your black ass some. We got it. Yo, Blockhead, what the fuck? All right. Before we continue, guys, I know I know you all get pissed off at me whenever I stop the videos consistently, but I mean, Blockhead Gaming, they're another one like EJ Lennon. Them niggas be scaring the shit out of me. I don't want to talk about specific instances on what happened, but you know, let's just say they have an answer for everything. Do you need do you need a piece of gear? Well, hey man, we got a suggestion for you. Look into this. Oh, do do, do you need some sort of um, substance per se? We got your back, man. <laughs> Look into it. I'm like, okay. Do you need a body to be moved from one location to another? Uh, yeah, sure, we got it. I think I think Blockhead Gaming, honestly. On, on some real shit, these are the motherfuckers I would go to if I had a body that I want. A, a mur if there was a murder, I would go to them. They seem like they're down for whatever. You, it's hard to find dependability like that. It's scary to find dependability like that. And them boys got it locked down. Oh, Fuck. I don't portray you that way. You portray yourself thank that you, way. Block. That's why I use video clips of you portraying yourself that way. T Big T, thank, thank you. Thank you. Diss track. I mean, that's kind of what I started. Hold on, I'm got the pause these. Like thank you, though, guys. You didn't start Big T, give tracks. me a second, bro. If you want to make the claim that you popularized them, that's perfectly legitimate. Yeah. Yeah. You just really went hard and you just got to give Wait a minute. Big T says, are you on cocaine, my nigga? Keep banging. The <laughs> no, I'm not on any fucking bumps, nigga. I'm good. I'm good. I ain't going to go... <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Anyways, donations are going to be paused for now, guys. And we'll continue them Offer. after this. Well, I don't want your props. You can shove your props straight up your ice hole because I think you're a garbage human <laughs> being and I want nothing to do with you. Garbage but human being! You? Shit, that's a little good, bit sir. extreme. So he made sure to put this at the start of the video so everyone sees it, right? Of course I did. Why wouldn't I? You're, you're acting as if this is some Logan Paul feud. Oh, I'm not shit. here to be friends with exactly. you, okay? I'm here to explain why you're worthy of criticism. But out Boom. of everyone, I should not be the one calling me out for it. 
Sauce. Rape is good. Yeah. Like, I know I fucked up, but like, I was really out of I feel like this is going to be reiterating everything that we said well, when we watched it. pretty horrible comprehension because I was hardly calling you out for it. I used it as a point to illustrate that you can be criticized exactly. for it. Exactly. I didn't say that I'm morally superior to you because it seems like he has this disregard for what he can be criticized for. What would he say? And I just want to spell it out. Hey, dumbass. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. did something stupid. We said the, the same past. thing. You can be criticized for it. If she's not mad, why are you guys mad? But anyways, I guess sorry isn't enough. Oh, God. I mean, I guess I really... This motherfucker's crazy. In this video, you're hyper-focused on the idea that uh, people aren't forgiving you even though you've apologized and uh, she's clearly good. not mad at you and uh, you've done all you can to prove that there's no bad blood between you two. And that's fine. That's a good first step. You, you kind of have to show that you've changed. Didn't I give but him props what you've done in this video is you've shown... That you have you not haven't changed, changed at all. Yeah, yeah exactly. I feel bad because not to just you though, just to all the rape victims out there, and just like it wasn't funny. You know what I mean? No, you can't. I'm oh, sorry. Not... I know, I know, I know. Performance I've seen in my. Lino. Nice, nice. Forget about the apology. You, you figured it out. Idubs has jokes too, where his viewers know that he's joking. Oh, it's a single piece of paper that says "nigger faggot." <laughs> 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 the fuck he gay? I can't wait to see how does response to this. Nigger faggot. We get on your real slot gay shit. Fuck what he talking about. Great oh, job, God. dude. You, you won the argument that I never made by showing clips of your black friends reacting to me saying the word nigger. You sure are very witty and know how to deconstruct an argument. It, it did seem like it was completely left field. Big words. It made like, no sense. Why did he bring that up? That was in the video roasting me is someone that does it more than anyone on YouTube. So if you're gonna call anyone out on it, call out PewDiePie. This isn't content. You cop missed the joke, man. What, what's we, wrong with you? We can't yes, if I were to make already. a content cop on PewDiePie, I'd mention how he stretches all of his videos out to ten minutes. I'd mention how he. McColonel, I don't know what that emote means, dog. Don't ask me. <laughs> I didn't put it there. Or maybe I did. Literacy I don't know. videos with ads. There's things to criticize PewDiePie on. But guess what? He's not nearly as much of a fucking douchebag as you. A lot of people seem to that, think this was though. your best point in the video, but I couldn't disagree more. This was a fucking terrible point. Well, I mean, it's, like it's tantamount monotonous. to me mentioning, hey, by the way, dude, your friend Tana that you vlog with, she said the word nigger. How you gonna support a guy who probably says the n-word? Because they're irrelevant! Gabby Show, another pretty irrelevant YouTuber. Damn, I guess mm -hmm. I do say that word a lot. I mean, I guess I'll Thanks, Colonel. words. No, the reason I showed you all those clips of you saying irrelevant was to show how much of a hypocrite you were being. If I actually we wanted- No! That shit got so much dislikes. That shit got so many dislikes. Let's watch his most popularest video. No. No he, one oh, oh, okay, this is new argument. is a person who advocates popularism. Most popularist what is video. Ah. Into the video. You can't even use the excuse that this is Ebonics. This is not Ebonics. Good. This is more syllables than Ebonics. You're making it harder rep on yourself. Is, rep, rep. Why should I correct a child that says Amalance or Samich? Well, I guess that accumulated a lot of haters. That's not a joke. That's not a joke. Why aren't we hearing these made up words in your song? Stop skipping, nigga. Why? Why should I not fucking skip? This nigga's saying the same shit. Like it's like I'm seeing the same videos we played over and over again. You have to you have to forgive me. Sometimes I just get fucking bored, all right? So if I skip Consider that a plea to my sanity, so that way I don't goddamn go to sleep here. Can I get an Etika sleep emote, please? Jeez. This shit seems over. Like, we get it. He's the nigga's dead. Got a green HX, thanks. Deus X, human defiance. 8 bit. Another stream, is life is good. Nice seeing you on it regularly. Keep up. Keep on keeping up. Thank you. Thank you. Insecure about his old videos? In this section, he brings up my old videos. Okay. Here we go. And it really pisses me off because he makes me look cute and adorable, but I'm that's not what I am. I'm a tough, edgy guy. But his main point is that people's content change with their personality. And to that I yeah. agree, lot, God. which is why I made a content cop on him in the first place. You said that you had high school humor. The point I'm trying to make is two years ago I had that high school humor. I, I was Can bread with 20, thank you. Thank you, Canbread. And what I'm proposing to you is that your humor has not changed very much at all in the span of two years. Someone has to say it, but like, what is that? Who, what is this, Vicky? I'm sorry, guys. Someone has to say it. And there was that one grandma in the wheelchair. She really liked chocolate, whatever, whatever. 
they kind of look alike. Yeah, I can't say it looks like the humor's that different from two years ago. Uh, yeah, but you know, it's like parody. So. Any bad bitches jumping in the pool and plus, she shit it on him, so it makes her. It I makes apologize it for this. open. Uh, I've done all but then that again, I can he's do. Saying I don't know what more you guys yeah. want me to do. So uh, let's just throw these skits. It's starting to the feel like a that shit make me look like. like it, the, the reason why I'm getting fed up is that now it just seems like it's less about exposing someone for their major major flaws and more just about like nitpicking. Oh oh, um, back and forth. It's kind of like 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 a slits like a shit slinging contest in a way, you know. So I mean, it gets more. Not, it's not really on personal opinion just yet because I mean, Idubs is still opening them up, but it's like the content cop exposed Ryskum completely. He didn't win that. I don't almost I almost feel that like this content deputy was unnecessary because Ricegum is already dead. His responses and everything were completely invalid. I mean we all saw that. And therefore the deputy was kind of unneeded in a way. I mean it's almost it almost lets you know that um IDubs did get a little bit triggered by how Ricegum puts things off. And that's the thing too. What makes IDubs get into a mode to even put a fucking content cop of somebody is that they have to kind of be able to trigger him. And you can see that IDubs is definitely he's he's a bit agitated. He I wouldn't say he's trolled, but actually no, he he might just be trolled to go ahead and do okay. another video on it. I mean, because you know Rice Gum's response is gonna be the same after this. I mean, if after the content cop originally he and he responded like, oh I didn't do anything wrong or oh he had an excuse for everything. Rice Gum would never be the type to admit that he was wrong in every situation. He did in some, which he gets props on. But I mean, at this point, it would be done. I'd be like, okay, well, he's a lost case. He already took the L anyways. There's no reason to pursue this any further. Everybody sees he's a fucking idiot. I mean, you can tell by the like and dislike bar. So, IDubs is starting to kind of like piss me off in the sense that, you know, this wasn't necessary. But maybe there's some other creative value or insight that he has to this. But so far, to me, it's the same fucking shit. Just calling Rice Gum out again on the shit that we already got again. What, or, or calling him out again on the shit that we already knew before, you know? There's nothing really new here. Like a piece of shit. How are you gonna tell me who I am as a person? As if you f***ing know me! Because he's fucking stupid. I, I mean, in this situation, he's stupid. So, fuck right. In that situation. My videos are or aren't. There has been so many lies surrounding my name. The Axis 101, man, he says it's lunchtime over here, so thank you for streaming late. There, I guess. I don't know who on earth Rice Gum is. And I only know IDubs from the meme, so forgive me. Oh, you mean the I'm Gay shit? Yeah, Rice Gum, he's like a popular YouTuber, man. He's got like a lot of clout for the um, diss track stuff that he used to do. I mean, but he, he has his asshole moments. I wouldn't say he's a garbage human being. I, I would just say he's a bit of a fucking asshole. He's a, he's a bit of a jerk. He, he's kind of self-conscious, egotistical in a way, you know? But if you hey, guys haven't heard whatever you need to defend yourself. Gabby Show came out and said that I hit... Landfill, like, sponsor, thank you. Right here. I'm sorry if I'm calling you out. I'm you cannot at all win the argument that all of your videos are jokes. So stop doubling down on this completely idiotic statement. But bro, there's a difference, all right? Like coming up to someone and filming them and then, you know, me being like, yo, could you not? And they keep going. It's completely different from me two years ago, you know, live streaming and someone asked me, am I live? And I'm just like, no. His point here is yeah. entirely moot because he it's gets moot, it yeah. wrong from the get-go because he's talking about consent, whereas a good portion of my video is actually talking about filming girls without their knowledge. Consent isn't even part of the equation when you completely rob them of the question can i film you yes or no however i don't actually knows a lot about filming people without consent let's see how many let's see what my monthly and they're at vidcon it's like a public event right over, where you agree to get me filmed hell yeah as Wait, if me filming hold on you nintengaru's in here again he says uh what, what did nintengaru say again you don't tell me you're talking about this fucking chucky e. cheese shit again nintengaru he says i give in i'll stop talking about chucky e. cheese if you read this oh god all right what the fuck is this, is this something? The story of Chuck E. Cheese. Why is this nigga so obsessed with this shit? All right, I'll check it out later, bro. Right now, we gotta finish this. Do it, VidCon, while you're checking your social blade numbers. Stop reading is donations. All... Nigga, there's literally nothing new in this fucking video. We already get it. Like, like Rice Gums, he took the L. What else is there to discover? There's almost no reason to even talk about this shit anymore. I think this is going to be the last stream that I ever interact with this stuff because now it's getting repetitive. I don't know, man. It's, to me, it just feels very stale. Comparable to you uh, breaking someone's phone because they were Snapchatting you or you lying to girls on your stream. Yo, what up? It's your boy, Ryan.
boy rice. What? Are you really criticizing me for making a parody? I was gonna explain my lyrics regardless. No. Uh, you see, a parody might involve some comedy in there somewhere. Uh, this was completely devoid of comedy. Thank you, Mike. There's a ton of YouTubers down there just trying to rap. They need to stop. I was being a pompous asshole character, like all these people in the Genius videos. The video in the lead, the Good. video with the most views at the time, was something about the Ariana Grande thing. I kind of just forgot about it, and I really didn't get any tweets. You know, after two weeks, no one really brought it up, and I just went on with my life. That 10K might come in handy 20 years down the line. And I know there's going to be that Look, one. You're not guy, paying like, oh attention. God, right, the, are you? Are you? Boy, there's nothing to pay attention to. The there's challenge. nothing new being said. You see, when you run a giveaway, as soon as you promise an amount of money like I'm giving away 10 grand, that money is no longer yours, okay? You have already come to terms with I'm giving this money away. You don't need to give it to Colossal, even though he's the rightful winner. You don't need to give it to the person who clickbaited the Manchester bombing video. What you absolutely need to do is donate it to charity. So I've included two links down below, one to the Manchester bombing fund, and one to the most recent Las Vegas shooting. So I think both of those are very appropriate, whichever one you happen to choose. Show some sort of verification on Twitter. Don't make a fucking video about it. I'm sick of this, man. All this ghostwriter stuff with oh. allegations. Like, there were no proof of... Like, people... Did he admit himself that he had a ghostwriter? It wasn't just him sending me shit like... My neighbor, have you seen I this? I was sending um... bars, he was sending bars back and forth. I just want someone to look over and help me. Like, I feel like it'll be a better song that way. I got you, bro. Then, I mean, I dropped a lot of, like, books, So he got compensated for his time. He saw items do this when he filmed himself, like, writing the song. And, I mean, it's a good idea. I mean, it could clear up all the ghostwriter stuff. You aren't paying attention. You're a I don't... You think about me there's nothing to pay night. attention to. There's nothing new. Quiet, but you might as well be Asian because you're obsessed with the rice. Yeah, that's sure to clear up the allegations. Doing a satirical montage of lyric writing. This guy is literally in love with me. He's obsessed with me. Get off of my dick, bruh. He's in love with me. He's obsessed with me. Get off my dick, bruh. You hear that, guys? That's the battle cry of someone who just lost. Leafy made a better response than this, without a fucking doubt. Jesus Christ. Okay, I don't this know about that one. This is going to be my last response <laughs> buried on this topic, himself, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, watching. Well, well. I will now leave you guys with the conclusion to the Hype Beast Saga. Okay, here we go. We, now we got some actual entertainment. Yo, Lil Bloom, thank you. What the fuck? Nigga got him tied up. Hey, what the fuck is that? What's he getting hit with? Lil Boom, thank you. What the fuck? The nigga's locked in a room, just forced to watch Hypebeast content? Oh, he's got a mustache. What the fuck is this? Oh, it was gum that he got thrown at. Okay. He's selling like a hotel? He missed the Ghost Rider proof. We know he was using a Ghost Rider. Oh. What the fuck? He's in Vegas? What the fuck? I don't care. Like, we know he had a Ghost Rider. Like, there's nothing new there. Do you get what I'm saying? Why? Like, it's not about not paying attention. There was nothing new being said. He, he bought up the same old fucking shit that we had known before. I need to find a police officer. Thank God he added entertainment value Stand. to the end of this. The nigga was oh he's in the Aria, okay. I want to say boy was in Why is this nigga I in Vegas? Officer? That's post? It would have been great if I didn't get spoils of this. That nigga post is in there, bro. Oh no <laughs> Shit Sheep squad, sheep squad. Sheep uh. squad, sheep squad. Sheep squad, sheep squad. Sh -sh 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 sheep squad. It's a response, oh, retard. No. Yeah, it's a response, but the response doesn't bring up anything new. Like, it, all it, to be honest with you, I mean, if you have like, a, if you have half a brain, then you would know that the response was this wasn't necessary. I mean, sure he did it just because, but 
The reason why he did is because maybe he felt like his arguments that he made in the original content cop were actually a bit shaky thanks to how Rice come responded to them. Because if there's one thing that I'll give Rice, he kind of know, even if he's speaking complete garbage, he presents his argument in such a powerful way with how his vocal tone is and the way he constructs sentences, even though some of the words he was putting together were garbage. Like that, that, was, a, that was a funny little point that Ida was pointed out. But everything that... Al Rice Gum comes off as extremely convincing, and that's part of his personality on camera there because he, he's like an authoritative figure, even though he doesn't look like it. But when he talks, he just bombards you with so much shit at one time. So I guess maybe the way he presented it and how he made himself look like such a victim that made IDub say, "Okay, I gotta fucking, I gotta make another video. I gotta end his career. I gotta do him in right now, dirty." But because of the stance that he had, I mean, the response that IDubs gave him. Rice gum was a bit, it, it it seemed like in the original content cop, it was not only pointing out his flaws, but doing so with a huge entertainment twist. And I he had entertainment in this second video too, but it was not on the level like a content cop originally was. It was more of like, no, you were wrong. I was right. And then like a tiny little hints of comedy here or there. I mean, it, it seemed more condescending than anything. And to be honest, it kind of seemed like bullying in a little bit too, because I mean, Rice comes, he's done. He's fucking done. He looked like a fucking idiot from that response that he had. And then the response that you respond to, to the idiot with Ida's response was kind of like, uh, I don't know. I wasn't really feeling it too much. But what I actually am kind of looking forward to more, because he's such a fucking moron in some ways i'm actually looking forward to seeing where rice comes response was because i know that he's probably going to try to present it in such a fucking ridiculous manner that i mean it might actually be more entertaining than i dubs content deputy response to rice comes response i mean it, it sounds ridiculous right but i i think this might actually be kind of funny just to see this nigga fucking spaz out again i mean i don't know let me see Watch the beginning. Uh, let me see here. Etika, you're an idiot. He said at the beginning he made this video only because Ricegum got his points wrong in the response. Yeah, but I mean, that doesn't change the fact that the points that he got wrong, we already knew were wrong. Like, nobody nobody sided with Ricegum after his response video. I mean, we all knew he was fucking stupid for it. He got, like, and so therefore, IW's soon as like, yeah, he's wrong. He's stupid. He, he's definitely uninformed. And I mean, we knew that already. I knew that at least. I have a brain to be able to think, yeah, there's no way that Rice Gum wins this thing. I, I, I don't think the response was necessary. But I mean, if it gets more fucking content, then hey, why the fuck not, right? Hold on. I'm gonna pull up um, Rice Gum's shit here. Because now he made a fucking eight minute long response. Oh, wait. Oh, no. This wasn't even a response. This is his fucking... What does this say? Um, his... He's explaining the lyrics behind his fucking diss track. Oh god, okay, I don't know if I want to see this shit either. Oh god, do I even want to see this shit either? Alright guys, now I'm there filming, man. I just can't wait to go to sleep, wake up, make my music video over public, and this all be over with. Over there. This guy did all the... Effect. Wait a minute, what? Wait a minute, no way! I just saw a comment that was crazy! I just saw a comment that was crazy! Wait a minute. He said, a comment just said this. Dude, there are idiots out there. Rice gum can twist the truth. There will be those who believe him. So he had to speak to those idiots. That's the thing that's pissing me off. IDub's response video to a, to me, not necessary. Fucking regurgitated information. He's just preaching to the choir again, right? Well, it wasn't necessary. But you're telling me that there's people out there so stupid to actually think that Rice gum won after his response video? To the point where, yeah, Idubs had to make a response because people think that Rice Gum won. Who the fuck in their right mind thought that he walked away from this with a W? Rice Gum's in the ground right now, thanks to this shit. That's why it's like so stupid to me. Idubs didn't need to do a fucking video. When fighting against Idubs, you don't fight the man. You admit your faults sincerely and fix them if possible. I guess Rice Gum didn't get the memo. Well, no, he didn't get the memo. He's fucking insecure and he's defensive. Like, that's fucking dumb. So you see, that content deputy video wasn't meant for me. Because for people who already knew how the fucking beat went, I mean, it was done. It was a wrap. I thought it was going to be kind of like, um, I don't know. I didn't expect the shit to piss me off like it did. It, the shit was kind of like, it, it was extremely complacent. It was the same shit all over again. But I mean, it just, I mean, it, what it did is prove that Ricegum was more of an idiot. But the thing is, is that if you have people that walked away from the Ricegum response thinking that the nigga won, then I mean, those niggas are the fucking idiots. <laughs> like, you can't talk to idiots, bro. Like, that's the thing. That, that's one of my stances. I mean, if you want to make a point against someone initially just to get it out there to make sure that people know that they're full of shit, 
the first time, then that's fine. But the second and the third time, I mean, idiots will believe what idiots want to believe. So you don't fucking respond after that point. But I mean, whatever. Um, at this point now, I really honestly don't feel any need to watch this shit because it's just Rice gonna being a fucking way, dumbass though, at this point. Like he's H3 just fucking being an idiot. This oh, nigger. Like H3, you know, he's kind of over. Oh, he God. No, way. no, 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 no. All right. That I'm not fucking watching at all. <laughs> this, shit, this shit is just gonna be fucking dumb as hell. All right, but you know what? I think this is the end of the saga. We all, I don't care what the fuck an idiot thinks watching these. Rice Gum definitely lost this fight. Idubs won without a question. From this point forward, I, I'm, I'm, I'm done. Because now I'm getting fucking bored. I'm getting pissed off. This shit is not, it, it's not fun for me anymore. <laughs> it's not, it's the same shit. But watch Pyros? Fuck no, I ain't watching that lesbian's video. <laughs> Who is this cute little lesbian? <laughs> And why is her pussy so... That's a joke. It's a meme, by the way, all right? I, I don't actually mean any offense by that. It's just, you know, it's a meme. Because they can look like a lesbian when you first did the face reveal. Do you remember that shit? <laughs> okay. Anyways, um, well, you know, call it out. Wait, what? <laughs> Go watch Eminem's freestyle? Nah, I ain't watching that nigga freestyle. I mean, well, I heard... I keep hearing that his freestyle was actually some dope shit. That's the thing. Oh, yeah, let me continue. Yeah. Sorry I paused donations for so long. and It was just, you know... I had to motherfucking get the point across. Um, go on Reddit fifty fifty. No, 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 I got some other plans, bro. Ryu says, "Esketi, e e um, long time fan, but I'm finally donating. Thanks a lot, Ryu. Um, thank you to everybody else who had donated earlier too. Um, the shit was just, uh, it, it was just. I had to explain myself a little bit because motherfuckers were thinking that I was being stupid, and no, I had to explain to them. You know, you, it, it's, I, I can't do repetition." Of the same old shit. You, I, I can barely fucking finish a game. <laughs> because I'm, I get tired of playing this shit on the stream so much. So, I mean, for me, everything's on to the next one. Constantly moving. Fast. Stimulation. En engagement. Constantly. Boom, boom, boom. You know? Um, anyways, guys. Uh, but then again, that could not even be a sign of intelligence. That could be a sign of motherfucking, <laughs> a motherfucking low attention span. Uh, that, could be, that could be bad, too. <laughs> you know? But, I mean, hey. Anyways, guys. I, I do have some plans, though. I don't know. Like I said, it's gonna be a long night. Hmm. Thinking about intelligence, huh? Bringing up that conversation. How smart do you think you are? What's the last, in the chat right now, can you tell me what was the last test that you took? Has it been a while? Has it been a long time since you put pen to paper to fill out Good. an exam? Or did you do the shit yesterday? I want to see. What's the last test that you took? Was it a math test? Was it the SATs? Was it the motherfucking, um, was it the Regents test? What was yours? The PSAT? A lot of motherfuckers talking about the PSAT. Oh, okay, all right. I, I forgot that that was, um, that was actually um, around this time period that that test goes down. That's actually a really important one. Wait a minute, sponsors, what is that? <laughs> I don't get what that symbol means. Jay Nathan says, hey, what's up, my boy? I hope all is good, as I always say. You know, damn well, this ain't gonna be no chill stream, nigga. What kind of fucked up shit do you have in mind for us tonight? No, no, I'm just asking, generally, what kind of um, scholastics people have been up to lately? You know, I wanna see. All right, so you boys, it seems like a lot of you dudes had, niggas took their MCATs, apparently? Boys had an algebra test? Okay, wow. Listen, people are really saying Rice Gums fans thought that he won? To me? I would never waste a single breath on that shit again. As a matter of fact, I gotta go to his motherfucking... And before we continue, I, I'll, I'll continue asking you about your scholastics in a second. But, you know, I just gotta see. Did niggas really go at his video thinking that he won? I dubs County Cup, this track, Freak the Police official music video, and... Let me see what the like-dislike ratio All right, is. He still had a... He still had a lot of likes, even of though he had more dislikes. Wow. Niggas re These motherfuckers think Rice Gum won! They think he won. That's insane. But you know what? I mean, the thing that also makes it repetitive even more. Didn't I predict this? I told you all from Jump Street, this is not going to destroy Rice Gum. He's going to walk away from this unscathed and probably stronger than ever. Because the difference with Rice Gum and Leafy is that Rice Gum actually makes funny content. I he he he's a jerk. I don't I don't think he's human garbage. I think he's a fucking asshole. He has a lot of flaws. But he is fucking entertaining. And even if you... Like, I can admit that he lost and still watch a video of his and have a fucking laugh, you know? So, I mean... Yeah. He's gonna be unscathed. There's not gonna be a way to put Ricegum down the way Leafy was. It, it, it's, it's complete... Yo, know, he'll walk away. It's all good. But anyways, like I was saying... So, motherfuckers think that they, uh, they got their brains in check. Y'all motherfuckers think you smart and shit? Well, boys, let me tell you something. Every now and then... I feel the need to put you dudes through the ringer. 
you get so caught up in these chill streams. Oh, wilding with Etika. Just, just being a savage with Etika. A regular old knight. Motherfuckers out here sometimes don't think about using their noggins. And that's the problem. You think I don't care about scholastics? Of course I do. So you know what, boys? You think it's a game? It's not. We got a little something prepared, and this is gonna put your brain to the test. We, my boys, tonight got a motherfucking Kahoot. Let's go, niggas. Are y'all ready? Are y'all ready for it? A Kahoot tonight to test your knowledge, to put your brains to work. Are motherfuckers ready? I don't know. I don't know. What's that Kahoot emo? Who put that there? Who put that there? <laughs> Ray Risu, thank you. Wait, a Pornhub link. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Yo, what the fuck? This was recorded in the... This is some fucking crazy shit. Why is it sucking his dick? Is that his fetish? That must be his fetish. Wow. Wow. There's all kinds of stuff out here, man. That was insane. Um. Anyways, we got a Kahoot. Today, we're going to put your brains to the test and see if you can stand with the best, all right? Y'all motherfuckers, y'all motherfuckers be thinking you can get away with not being smart over here. No, no, your boy puts your heat. I wanna see them grades come out, all right? Are you ready? Now, if you don't know what a Kahoot is, you're fucking dumb and you need to get out. <laughs> but no, I'll explain it real quick, don't worry. Cummies XD saying, you asked for it, my nigga. R.I.P. Cummies, what is this? Is this another? Why? Why is this something that exists? Is this age restricted on YouTube? It has to be age restricted. It's not age restricted? What the fuck? Wow, that's some, I don't even know if I wanna see that. Bro, I know I said, okay, I know I said send me fucked up shit. First off, I don't know why that video is on YouTube. This isn't like the, 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 hold on. I'm supposed to be putting you to the test, not to, Cummies, thank you. Thank you for your donation, man. I, th what you sent me is really fucking weird, but <laughs> Orange is saying, my nigga, how's it going? It's been a while since I last donated. Orange is, thank you. He says, I think it was the last Persona stream you did. In any case, I'm ready to go tonight. So if you got, through, if you got some shit planned, let's do it. Yeah, this, this is the shit that's planned. All right, so what, we're, what I'm going to do is set this thing up. Before I continue, I'm Sky Aether. Thank you. You niggas haven't stopped with the donation since the stream started. That's fucking insane. Um, he says, I have work at 4 a.m., but fuck it. I want to chill with my boy. No bitch niggas, no snitch niggas. I got you either. Um, thank you. I hope, Hopefully you're going to have a good time in here. Sorry, we're having a lot of donations come in. So, you know, I want to I wanna get to the uh, like point of this whole thing, though. I got to explain this. So, basically, on a Kahoot, you go to your cell phone, and um, it's going to give you a website. You put the pin in. And it's going to be a, a, a pop quiz, a trivia thing. So everybody in the stream will be able to participate. And the thing that makes this interesting is that all the times that we've had before, you know, the prize has been like, you know, a follow on Twitter or something like that. But, you know, I'm not that generous with my Twitter follows. I always am very, like, strict on that. So, you know, what the prize is going to be. Are you ready for this? Because not only is this going to be a chance for you to showcase your brain, but you're also going to be able to flex your wallet. The top three winners, first, second, and third place for this Etika World Network themed pop quiz, each win a 
fifty dollar. Well, I was gonna give fifty dollars on like uh, whatever game console of their choice, but I'll just I'll PayPal you fifty dollars. You'll win fifty dollars if you get the first top three places here. So hey, you know. That might help you to get a game that you kind of liked, or maybe you can use that on some Amazon purchases or whatever. Or maybe you could buy yourself some condoms so that way you'll be wrapped up for Halloween. Or maybe get yourself a costume. I don't know. There's a lot of things you can buy with $50. A bottle of Patron. You, you know, you can go in with the shit. Therefore, hey, get a little extra cash in your pocket. A little, it's, it's nothing crazy. You know, $50. I mean, $50 is a lot of money, but it's not a lot of money. You know, it's kind of that weird area. But, hey, why not? So here we go, I'm about to set this thing up. It's been a little while, so I'm a bit rusty at this. Um, I'm gonna continue the donations now while I can log in and all this other stuff and then get this ready. But yeah, if you have a cell phone, that's all you need. It'll tell you the website, you go there, and then you can participate in the Kahoot and win, well, or you can get a chance to win um, $50. <laughs> you know, hey, tell me, that sounds cool. Are that niggas ready though? Yes, yes, my niggas, yes. $50 each, it's not like 50, 30, and then, you know, 20. No, it's 50 for first place, 50 for second place, and 50 for third place. So, you know, $150 is being, you know, given to the winners who win the top three places in this Kahoot today. So, you know, are y'all motherfuckers ready? Are y'all ready? We about to start this thing up. Let me see my Kahoots. Uh, and I'm going to go to this one. And I'll tell you this. I'll tell you this. This one is going to be one of the hardest ones. This is the, actually the eighth Kahoot that we've ever done. And it's gonna get real, my boy. Real, real. Are y'all niggas ready? Now, remember, get your cell phones out. You're gonna wanna go here. And this is the EAT number eight. The Etika Academic Test. <sighs> I feel good about this. Haven't done this in a little while. I know niggas are gonna like it. Um, Arthur Graham saying, no bitch niggas. Bet. A live leak video? Oh my God. What, why? You know, no, actually, I'm not surprised. You know what? Bring it on. I'm ready. Let me see this shit. Let me see. Live leak? I'll take it. Collector A, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How far back do these donations go, dog? Here we go. Let me see here. Oh, what is this? Warning. Items. Wait, warning item. Man splits face in two upon diving into water. Might contain content that's not suitable for all ages. Oh, my God. This, this is... Nah, bro. I don't know if I can watch this. He splits his face in two? All right. Let me, let me just... Oh, no. Oh, I can't show that on stream. Fuck, we're supposed to be doing the EATs. We're not supposed to be watching this fucked up shit. Let me put this over here. No, you can see it over there. Uh, okay, back to the game. <laughs> Anyways, Kurisu Makisi. Thank you. We're going to go to Classic. And um, ready to join. Is this how it works? Let me see here. Let me make sure this thing is okay. So now we... Wait a minute. How do we? I forgot, man. It's been a little while since I've done these cahoots, dog. I can't remember how this thing goes. How do I randomize the questions? Do I do I just go here? Um, uh, no. Close that. Save that. Play that. There we go. Oh, here we go. Okay. Um, it says right here you can enable ancestry, randomize order of questions, randomize the order of answers. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Enable two-step, join in. Okay, so now here's the thing. It's not only about answering the questions correctly, but also the speed. Now, the more that you're able to get correct, it'll help your score, but let's just say that you answer it and it's like only one second. Bam, you get like a bunch of points. I don't know exactly how many, but the faster the better. So just put haste on it. You know, you don't want to wait all the way until the end and then hit the right one. You want to make sure that you get that shit early, all right? It'll help. It'll help, you know? We're talking $50 here, so it's serious now. Dude, when there's money on the line, the shit gets real. So trust me, this is going to be real, okay? Um, Hero of Trap saying, hey, Etika, um, just had someone from Google visit my campus for a talk. And also, here's some even more good Splatoon porn. Fucking, this nigga is always sending me some shit. Right now, I got to focus on the Kahoot. Right now, it's time. You know, like, I'm going to ask you guys, can you guys hold off on the donations, man? Because this shit is getting a little bit crazy. Motherfucking, I'm trying to, I, I got to remain focused here. If, if you could hold on to your money real quick, guys, that would be great. It'll just make it easier for me to get through this thing, all right? Uh, I'll, I'll definitely read out the ones that happen from here on. But, you know, I just want to make sure that I focus entirely on this Kahoot. Because this is, I can't, I can't afford to fuck this one up, all right? Now we're going to start the thing up. So we're going to go to Classic. And now it's going to say ready to join. Uh, let me see. I'm going to zoom this thing out. Get out your phone or your tablet, whatever the hell you have. Now you're going to go to this website, kahoot.it. 
and then you're going to put in the game pin 203704. So that would mean if you're on the browser, you go to this website and you put in that pin. If you're on your phone, go to this website again and put in this pin. So join up. But the thing is, wait a minute, wait a minute. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving this. I'm leaving this. I can't leave this thing. Leave, leave it, leave it. The problem with this is that if you join in, I'll have no way to know who the hell you are. So make sure that if you... Because if the p top three people, I, I can't find them, then that'll make everything useless. So make sure that you at least put your Twitter handle or your you know email or some way that I'll be able to find you as your name. I mean, it would suck if you won and then your name is fucking Minecraft Fuckboy 2592. And, you know, how am I going to find your ass through that? So, I mean, yeah, use a name that I can distinguish you and locate you. OK, let's start it up again. My bad, I just had to uh, make sure that I get that point across, all right? Game classic, let's go. Now go back to the website. I think it's gonna be a new pin and you wanna try to enter that shit, all right? Oh, it's 203704, all right, again. Yeah, so go back to the website, boom. There we go, this is the pin. That's the website, that's the pin. Yuka, thank you for the spawns of. $50, bro, I don't know, man, $50. That's good money right there. Y'all could do something with that. <sighs> All right, so about to hit a thousand players. All right, we have thirteen thousand people in the stream right now. Motherfuckers think y'all ready to take on the EATs? I don't know. I don't know if these boys are ready. Master Rosie saying, "Did you hear I Dubs built a Chinese restaurant? He's serving up some mighty fine fried rice tonight." Yeah, I bet he is. <sighs> rice and gum. That's a fucking horrible combination, actually. Then again, is that uh, is that like a real thing? It actually sounds like it would be. Don't they have like rice cakes, rice gum? Wouldn't that be a thing? What the fuck is going on here? It feels like my it feels like my Kahoot is crashing. There's no room. What the fuck? There's a room limit now? Oh come on! All right, I gotta close this. Now, now I'm um, play it. All right, let me make sure there's maybe there's like a limit that I can break here. Maybe I can just say, oh no, let everybody in. Require players to rejoin after each Kahoot. Automatically move through questions. No. Enable two-step join. No, show minimize intro instructions. No. Oh, what the fuck is this? You really have to... Okay, let's try one more time. Damn, Kahoot, what are y'all doing? Why can't we just have a bunch of niggas inside? A new one? All right, I'm going to make a new one right now. I just don't know why this shit ain't working. I see fucking bots. Niggas have bots in the Kahoot? Dog, it's not that serious. And now this thing isn't even working. What the fuck is this? All right, so join in now. Join in now. Try to make it work now. I don't know, dog. There's no room? Kahoot can't handle the coonery. Wow, Kahoot is slipping. The Kahoot machine broke. Damn, it really did break. We fucked up Kahoot. It says zero players. I know, that's a damn lie. Wow, come on, dog. All right, I'm going to try one more time, boys. Damn, I did not expect it to fuck up like that. Come on, Kahoot. All right, so my Kahoots. I worked hard on this quiz, too. It's got some bomb-ass questions. We're going to have to continue it without... Damn, I, I guess we're going to have to continue it without... Regard for the limit. I mean, get in there as fast as you can, man. Because this thing is not going to hold everybody. So make sure if you're trying to get in, that you do it ASAP, all right? I'm about to hit the button for Classic. It's going to start it up. And then, boom, go in there. Damn, I worked hard on this Kahoot. It took me like two hours. Sometimes it's hard to think of questions, man. Looney Boy saying, what is up, Etika? I can't donate too much, but I can give you a juicy site to start up some crazy shit. But be careful, though. The banner ads on this night on this site is not safe for work. Bestgore.com. Oh, God. I'm going to sleep. Dog, I don't know what the hell's up with this thing. We broke Kahoot. It's loading for so long. It literally doesn't work. Damn. This wasn't a problem when we had, like, two or 3,000 viewers per stream. I don't think the Kahoot is made to handle 13,000 viewers. This sucks. We broke it. Niggas broke Kahoot tonight. I knew we were going to get into trouble, but this? We broke a website that's made to... Oh, what the fuck is this? I'm seeing porn everywhere. Why? I got to talk to Kahoot on Twitter now. Kahoot. Tweet at them. 
please fix Kahoot. Thank you. Wow, man. Yeah, this website is fucked. This thing is buffering and all that, man. Ah, fucking son of a bitch. The Kahoot servers are down. Someone, someone just told me the servers crashed. Whoa. So when we all, when, when, when 13,000 people flooded the servers, the whole website went down. This is crazy. How did you do this? We used to be able to play cahoots. We used to be able to go in and just have a good time and do the quests and it would be like a bunch of fun. Now, we shut the website down. <laughs> well, add this one to the list, boys. Before, the achievement we had was that we were the biggest cahoot to ever happen on the website because we had thousands of people in there. When we had like 6,000 people at one point. We have a new achievement to add to that list. We broke the Kahoot machine. I'm I'm proud of you, actually. To be real with you, I'm I'm proud. I feel like a I feel like a father right now. <laughs> Damn it! This is this is my plan though. My plan went to shit. What do we do now? <sighs> I mean, I had shit planned, but it's like, ah, uh, I really wanted to do this. The questions were so good. Maybe I have to control F5 the page. Try one more time. Try one more time, dudes. Snafu saying, yo, Etika, I am running for student. Go oh, here we go. Bam, it works. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Naughty nicknames beware. One click of your on your name and you're out of the game. Wow, okay. Snafu says, yo, Etika, I am running for student government. Can I get some free merch to promote your channel during the campaign? I don't have any merch right now. I have not been able to start any up. I really am confused when it comes to like how to set up a shop and I haven't found a good website for it yet. I think it would be funny and also I'm just kind of spending my money on what on you're, you're spending your money on what pink dink thank you thank you how far do these things go back he said I'm also kind of spending my money on this too dog I wish I had merch god damn that'd be dope oh we have more people now the servers are fixed when we talked to Kahoot did it work did it work we fi I guess they fixed it it actually worked wow look at that you know what? Hey, man, I'm glad to see it. I'm glad to see it. The servers are back up. Everything's good with Kahoot. All right, we're good. We can start the quiz now. Well, I mean, we got to wait for everybody to get in there. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. It can fill up more. We can get more niggas in there. 4,316. That ain't shit. Thursday night before PAX Prime, I set out on a mission to find Etika and give him a blunt as a welcome. I found other people like D1, C, and D, and even that bitch and even that bitch who and uh Velocify. next time we will smoke from solvino solvino bro all you gotta say is bro i'm solvino from the oh oh it's not looking good right now boys there's bots what bots suck how do you make so many bots what the fuck? Why would you even make a bot? How am I going to give the prize to a bot? It's impossible. It's impossible. You niggas ruined Kahoot for me. I can't. You won't win and get a prize if your one of your bots takes it. That's so crazy. That is crazy, man. Why niggas always got to ruin the fun for everybody? Thank you, though, Solvino. I'm looking forward to it. He said he found other people like D1 and C and D. Yeah, I know D1 would go in with that. <laughs> Stan says, rest in peace, Grape Cun. Who the hell is Grape Cun? Damn, niggas fucked up Michael. Hoot. What the fuck? Oh, the, um, the little penguin dude. Oh, wait a minute. He died? Damn. It was like a little penguin that kind of like the anime character cut out and he would always like be close with it and stuff. And did he die? It's so sad. Damn, it's sad like my fucking Kahoot died. God damn it. Okay, well, I guess this isn't going to work. We have to find something else fucked up to do. We, we already we, we destroyed one website. How many more can we destroy? I feel like Beatrice right now. Jumping from planet to planet. Just, just blowing the shit up on the way. Now to go to Jackbox TV. Jackbox TV, is that another place where you can do like quizzes and shit? 
Jackbox.tv. Oh, this is the party pack, niggas. I don't want to fucking do this. It's not as fun. The Kahoot, at least you could have thousands of people do it. Sponsor only Kahoot. Damn, would I ever have... I think I might have to forcefully do that. I mean, I don't know. I don't want to do that right now, though. Damn. This music is going to drive me crazy, though. I'll tell you that much. Slowpoke, thank you for the spawns, love. Oh. Okay, well, you know what? If this isn't going to be good, then... Gotta, we, we gotta move on. We can't stay stuck on one thing, guys. We can't. Ah, oh, man. I had some, look at all these other cahoots that went down just without a problem. These quizzes went great. These were great. But now we can't even do the shit anymore. What if we tried to play an old one? What if we tried this? Let's try this soon. We, surely we didn't crash the service for everything, right? Try this one. Let's see if this works. Pro Beast with the spawns up. Thank you, Pro Beast. All right. Well, you know what? If this shit isn't going to work, change the code for the Kahoot. Oh, change the code. Why I just see the King Nappy pop in? Niggas had King Nappy in here. Yeah, bullshit. Uh, we have a uh, Dr. Don Von Doom. What's up, man? He says, Etiquette, you think a shit car for a packet of crazy found on this on eBay, a gallon of sauce, it's pronounced sauce for, wait a minute, you think a shit car for a packet is crazy, I found this on eBay, a gallon of Szechuan, Szechuan sauce for $25,000, I think we saw that on the stream before, man, it was crazy, because it's like this, it's only like a little thing like this, and niggas are selling it for cake, they're selling it for bread, bro, it's unnecessary. That shit's ridiculous. All right, so here we go. Are we good? Come on, keep it going, keep it going. We can fill this bitch up. Keep going, guys, keep going. We can fill it up more. We have plenty more people to get in there. 13,000 niggas. <laughs> 13,000 niggas to get inside. What are they? Why are you spamming my shit? Look at all these bots. Look at all these bots. The bots are in here more than the people. The people can't even get in because the bots are spam. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. What is this? What is this? Good. Nib and who are these niggas? Well, I mean. What is this? How how do people even do this? I don't need money. What the kind of kind of names are these? Where do you go to get a bot that gives over seven hundred Kahoot entrance? This dude Nib filled up like a fifth of the room all by himself. Claypot saying, "Hey man, I'm the dude formerly known as Super Epic Clay. That's you. What's up, man? It's been a while. It's been a while since I've seen you in here. I've been super stressed." I've been watching your archive streams as a relief. I drew you some quick fan art. Hold on, now. that's definitely worth a look there. Man, Super Epic Clay, he used to be one of my biggest ball busters, man. <laughs> now he's on my side. Well, I wouldn't say he's on my side, but he's definitely cool peeps, man. Let me see, what you got for me, bro? Is this some porn? I don't know what the fuck I'm looking at here. Is this you? Oh, no, no. Is that you? What the fuck is this? I'm a little scared now. This definitely didn't come out the way that you wanted it to because... Alright, well, you know what? What happens if we just start the quiz now? Oh, man. This is nothing but bots. There's nothing but bots, bro. Oh, but if we have two-step verification, we can completely avoid the bots. Maybe the bots are the problem. Maybe that's what's crashing my cahoots. But if we start up a new one and we enable the two-step verification, then I think we might be good. Hopefully, it's not that complex of a process. Thank you to all the sponsors that I missed out on, too. All right, here we go. We're going to start this again. Two-step verification enabled. On. And now, classic mode. Well, now let's try it. Now let's see those bots try to run amok again. Try to mess with my fucking Kahoot. 
Here we go. Here we go. That's how you do it. There we go. No bots now. Try to get in now, boys. Tucker Carlson the third. Thank you for joining the sponsors. I appreciate that, bro. So there we go. We go to the same website, and you're supposed to put in a pattern. I'm not sure how the fuck this works, but the pattern refreshes. Okay, I see. All right, let's go, boys. Let's go. Only four niggas? Wow. How hard is that verification? Jesus. Why is it taking so long for niggas to pop in? We should have way more people. No more room? What do you mean no room? We only got 14 niggas. Wow, no more room? The pattern broke? <laughs> what is this? Sylvie the Sylveon, thank you. Clay, I'm not sure why their thing didn't pop up the right way. Damn, we have a lot of fucking sponsors coming in. Jesus Christ, what the hell What the hell is going on here that we got so many sponsors? What are you niggas doing here? Why are you here for? I mean, it's not a bad thing. Okay, something's wrong. Something is fucking wrong, dude. This shit is not working. I'm still looking at this nigga with his fucking face split in half. The pattern is fucked up. How do you crash a pattern? Niggas fucked up my pattern? All right. Someone needs to help me. I, someone literally needs to help me because I'm so confused now on how to get this to work. They really crashed my shit. Juan says, hey, Etika. Nani? <laughs> That's what I was saying the whole time with these bots. Hey, bro, I've been a fan for two years now. and it's my first time ever donating. Joy-Con boys, where are you at? They're trying to get into my damn Kahoot, and the bitch is too full to even squeeze your damn foot in. I don't even know what's going on, bro. I'm trying to figure it out. I really want to play this tonight with you guys. I worked so hard on this quiz. I want, I want the academics to be tested here. I want you niggas to know the stream is meant for Brainiacs. And I can't even do that much. I can't even do that much. God fucking damn it. You know what? I'm going to try two more times. If this doesn't work, then we're, we're, we're going to have to move on. I can't stay stuck on this. Stream delay? Oh, the str oh wait. Retro says... Let me see. Retro says the stream delay plus the verification is messing up the entries. Oh. Damn, is there really no way to... Hmm. Is there really no way to make the delay less? Well, they have the super low latency thing, but I would have to end the stream and start it up again. Enable two-step... Let's try one more time. Let's try one more time. Just put in the pattern as soon as humanly possible, niggas. The stream delay... So you mean to tell me that the guys, the people who got into the stream before, actually guessed the pattern accurately without even seeing it? That's some fucking insane shit. Play Doki Doki Literature Club. It's too fucking slow for the stream. We, we would all get bored. All right, here we go. Now it's working, guys. Now it's working. All right, we're good. Everybody get your ass in here, man. If y'all trying to play this Kahoot right now, then get in there. Put that pin in. Join with this game pin and then the pattern. As soon as it changes, put in. Yeah. Leaving us plebs out is the high, is the low key the pattern. What the fuck? <laughs> Why would you put your name as this? How are people gonna know it's you, bro? Oh, I, I killed him by accident. Elino Elin Dover? Elin Dover? Stuck on pattern, it broke for me. Alright, well you know what? It's quite clear to me now. The streams have grown to the point where we can no longer play cohoots and have fun while doing so. It it's impossible. We can't do cohoots anymore. Wow, this is actually a very sad revelation for me. Something that we used to find so fun and engaging, interactive, it involved everyone. And now, all we do is destroy the website every time we try to do it. If it isn't the fucking... So here's what I think it might be. It might just be these hackers that are trying to DDoS the fucking thing since they're pissed off that two steps on. They're like, oh, really? You're going to try to stop my bots? My precious bots? All 780 of us? <laughs> well, we will overload your Kahoot with so many requests that you won't even be able to respond to the legitimate ones. I think that's what happened here. A nigga is literally just aiming his fucking robots to attack my shit.
Attica killed bend over. <laughs> Niggas killed my st <laughs> Niggas killed my throat. <laughs> they fucking killed my coot. <laughs> oh shit. They're fucking pissed. Wow. What the fuck is the pattern? <laughs> there is no pattern. It's over, bro. We can't do this tonight. Not this Kahoot. That shit can't go down. Master Rosie saying, hey, Etika, don't question this nigga. Just watch it. That's kind of a tall order, bro. But you know what? With how sad I... Okay, he says, don't question it. Just watch it. That comes in from Master Rosie. All right, Rosie. You know what? If you really are... Th if you really want me to do this, niggas could be... This could be anything. This could be a dick. This could be a dick. This could be a dick. Tails and Cosmo have sex. What would you like me to do? Let me see. Uh, you and me should fuck Cosmo. Then I'll take you up on your offer. Great. I'll grab my sexy cock. Enough. Why his eye looking like that? Why are you doing the people's eye? But did he just flash porn on the screen? Did he just flash porn? What the fuck? He flash porn on the screen. Oh shit! This extra stream has to go. Up. We have to make this adults only. This stream. Okay, god damn it. We're gonna have to. Oh, you fucking. How is this video still up on YouTube? This bitch has hentai in it. You son of a. Why did I look for it? Why did I look for it? I have to make this stream adults only now. Oh no, now I gotta go to my video manager. Damn it, niggas, are you kidding me? Look, I gotta literally go to my manager. Live streaming. Ah, well you know what, fuck it. I didn't plan on this stream lasting anyways. If we're gonna delete it right after the fact, then hey, whatever. We can deal, but Jesus, I was really trying my best not to. I said, wait a minute, is that porn? I felt like it was porn, it just flashed so fast. God damn it, you niggas. That one Riley saying, you dead ass broke the Kahoot, nigga. Holy fuck. I know. We, like, that whole, oh, the machine broke me. It actually happened. I can't believe that you dudes managed to do it. There used to be a time, like I said, where the only thing we did was just, you know, make record-breaking numbers. We broke the record. Legit. Live control room. I'm used, do you see this shit I have to do right now? Thanks to that fucking porn this nigga just made me look up on this damn stream. I gotta go here. Now I gotta go. All right, here we go. Stop streaming. That's something there. Um, Slate. Hey, we had 16,000 um, concurrent viewers at one point in the stream. That's fucking major. Look at that. Actually, this is the actual stream. The one that you're watching right now that you're seeing my black ass on. These are the numbers of it right now. And as you can see, total time viewed, 20,556 hours. That's a lot of fucking eyeballs watching this bitch right now. And then we had um, 16,000 viewers at one point. But all right, we need to fucking... I have to go, oh, I can see the damn chat right here. Good. Wait a minute, can I just kill a random nigga? I'm going to try to just kill a random nigga. You know what, why not? Uh, let me see here. You know what, I don't know who this nigga is. I'm sorry, but I'm just going to do this just for the fucking laughs. laughs. Some random dude just got killed permanently. Who was that? Who the hell is Panel Knight? I don't know, but the nigga's dead now. You know what? Since the Kahoot failed, we had to give a blood sacrifice to the gods as an apology for us not being able to follow through. And you know what? The Kahoot gods are pleased now. We destroyed their, their territory. We had to give them a body. And it had to be Panonite. Or whoever this nigga, what the fuck kind of a name is that? But wait a minute, we're, we're, we're not doing the right thing. We have to go to my settings and make this video age restricted right now. This stream has to go under. Ghost Kaiju said, so after the Pornhub link, <laughs> spider sex, I guess we're never getting an Etika watches Monster Musume in the foreseeable future. Isn't that that anime that has a bunch of those girls who have like animal parts and they actually all fuck at the end of the day? Also, the Kahoot problem is the ghost of Beef Boy 97. You mean Beef Stew 97. Uh, beef Stew spirit comes back to haunt us again. That's an old meme now. Niggas don't know. Good. A lot of these motherfucking 13,000 niggas are in here. But they don't know what the fucking references are. <laughs> the, the niggas weren't here when the when the real shit went down. Decepticon say, you realize there's a C in my name, right? It's Decepticon, not Deception. <laughs> well, you know, I fucked that one up before, I'll admit that. I saw it this time. He says, also, how did you fuck up Kahoot like that with your notorious ass? I don't know. 
We're, we're, we're fucking up everything right now. We're fucking up a bunch of commas. We, niggas just fucked up my stream. Now I gotta go make it age restricted. So you know what? I'm about to do it right now. This stream, hold on. I don't know if you guys will be ready for this, but this shit's about to go down right here, okay? As you can see, these are the settings of my um, stream. Um, you can see I have the automatically unlisted thing. Enable age restriction. I'm going to click that and make it yes. And now, this way, we don't get murdered by YouTube. Although, I don't know if I really have to, because it's only one frame. But you can never be too safe. So, I hope you guys are ready. I think we're about to split, like, half of our viewers. But you know what? Uh, I really... <laughs> I'm pissed. I mean, the video doesn't earn any money. But then again, YouTube has not earn any money anyway. So, I don't care about that. But it's just... Nobody's going to be able to find the stream now. And, uh, whatever. Fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> this stream is now adults only. Get the fuck out if you are a child. If you are under the age of 18, watch your eyeballs because this is not going to be a good scene for you. Thank you so much to all the donators. I know I missed out on some of you guys and I apologize from the bottom of my heart. I'm, I really do apologize that I wasn't able to see all of them. There were just so many. They were endless. They just didn't stop and we were trying to get things set up. I hope you guys understand. Yes, kids. Uh, this is this is this is for the adults, the big boys. All right. If you got on your big boy pants, this is the moment that you want to be in the stream for. Now, let's find something fucked up to do tonight. Sadly, the only thing that got fucked up was that kahoot. But there are ways to bounce back. There are ways to make amends. And one thing that we're going to do, I'm going to tell you a little something, man. Now, I'm sure you all know of. Uh, let me let me make sure this motherfucker is still here. Let me make sure this motherfucker is still here. Yo, we just lost mad viewers because the stream kicked out so many people at one time. We just lost like a thousand viewers. That bitch was like, wait, you you had 13,000 viewers? We jumped down to two, 12, excuse me, 12,000. Because it was like, wait, y'all niggas ain't of age. But wait a minute, doesn't that get to show you that a lot of people on here <laughs> are adults? <laughs> New niggas ain't adults. Oh, oh, we've lost a thousand viewers. A thousand people weren't of age. I have a feeling that most of these accounts that are of age of this 12,000 people are not actually of age. Y'all motherfuckers just said, oh, yeah, I'm 18. <laughs> you niggas ain't 18. These motherfuckers ain't 18. I know damn well there's more than a thousand of you niggas that are underage. What the fuck? I'm still here. <laughs> Nigga said, I'm still here. I'm still here, dog. You ain't gonna be here for too much long. Okay, so let me make sure this motherfucker is actually doing. Um, let me make sure he's still streaming because I, I I gotta call somebody out on some shit. I gotta call somebody out on some shit, man. Now, like I told you guys, I'm gonna be in LA soon. All right, yeah, he's still doing his thing. All right, so since I will be in California, love. Um, TwitchCon's gonna be legit. Now, there's a certain person that I'm going to have a little bit of an interaction with. I want you to guess who it is because there's a little bit of a point that I want to make with them. Wait, wait, wait this that's illegal? What's illegal? There's nothing illegal about that. <laughs> shit, we might be doing some illegal shit during the stream, but I mean, there's nothing, <laughs> there's nothing illegal about being in the stream right now if you're under eight. Well, actually, no, I, might, I don't want to say that on the record, but then again, the stream isn't going to be uploaded public, so fuck it, I can say whatever on the record. If you're, if you're under 18, Fuck it. Just just don't tell anybody. You just chill in the stream, man. It's not we're gonna show ass and titty. Gonna, no, no, what are we gonna do? Watch porn together, bro? What the fuck do you Good. what kind of bonding experience do you think this is gonna be? Um Clay Pot, what's up, man? I didn't get your link before. I don't know if it worked properly. He says, wait a minute, why does this thing show up so late? What the fuck? Oh, he says, I hate character limits. The link got cut off and it sent you the wrong tweet. So have another twenty dollars. Clay, super epic. Thank you very much, man. Um, he also says, here's the actual art. Now, this is the thing. Is this where the porn is going to be? Nigga said, <laughs> why would you say that name? Don't you understand the concept of evisceration? You don't break. You don't speak ill of the dead. Stop it. No, no. I'm not going to LA to be with that deceased, removed from existence person. No. I didn't see. Okay, yeah. Somebody guessed it already. Somebody guessed it already. So this nigga Ice Poseidon, man. Don't make contact with Ice nigga. Wait a minute. Lyra Paradox says don't make contact with Ice Poseidon? What's the problem here? What's the worst thing that could happen with me and Ice Poseidon meeting in LA for TwitchCon? <laughs> I don't see the problem. <laughs> but anyways, if there's one thing that I can tell you guys about TwitchCon, I'm, I'm, a, I'm going to have a shindig. I mentioned it before and I'll mention it now with some more details. Now, here's the thing. This is going to sound crazy. Damn, should I even mention this? Damn, since... But you know what? The stream's going to be deleted Good. later. So, whatever. Your boy... So... <laughs> oh, God. Am I really about to say this on camera? So, I'm planning a party, right? It's going to be a shindig on a monumental scale. 
and we're going to have I have two places rented out so that way we can have a bunch of niggas inside and we're gonna have liquor games of course just a bunch of food cater service and all this it's gonna be next level on top of the world type shit ej lennon says the same thing happened when rachel did a 24-hour stream with gabe and cindy oh she shut down kahoot how fucked up did this shit get that shit must have gotten fucking live so it's gonna be a motherfucking shindig it's gonna be legit i'm telling you niggas ain't gonna be ready for the party that i got planned niggas man all the other stuff that y'all boys be going to house man pussy party we're about to have a motherfucking this is about to be a rancid party this is gonna be like a stream in real life and who knows maybe we'd be in a position to actually stream something a little bit from there but you know i'm not counting on it because in real life streaming for me is like very um tedious because there's so many things to keep track of and i wouldn't have an assistant on on hand to help me out but um in terms of the actual party now you gotta make sure you have more than just liquor you need more than that and we're in california baby obviously we gotta add a little extra pizzazz to it and no i'm not talking like you know fucking heroin or some coke or whatever i mean some niggas get bumps if they want to i guess but you know that's not my uh, that's not my way but i mean you know <laughs> niggas got their recreational so you know they niggas do what they want to do niggas do what they want to do but the problem is that in la it's not, it's not exactly legal on a recreational scale. And I don't know if in LA, the dispensary scene is really up there like that. So it's a bit questionable, you know? I don't know. So I was saying that maybe we could have certain things shipped from certain places to make everything, you know, more, more copacetic. But I don't know, we were trying to figure it out. But anyways, so now bringing this into reference with that certain individual that I was talking about, <laughs> because the chat is going insane. Ghost Kaiju sent me a link to an X videos video. What the fuck is this? That says um, xvideos.com pterodactyl dinosaur spermo plasmoids. Also, the Kahoot looks like it's going kaput. I'm not sorry. That was a horrible joke. Please feel bad. That, that, was, that was really, really bad, dude. Hold on a second. How bad could this one be? This can't be worse than the fucking spider. JJ.am. I remember that website. That's fucking insane. Wow. They're they're flapping their wings. That that, that that's just stupid. I don't know, dog. Like that to me, <laughs> how do you get off on that? Whose dick gets hard to the idea of it getting sucked by a dinosaur? Why? Why? All right, so this nigga is still streaming right now. So I want to do something here because the the problem here is that this nigga Ice Poseidon hit me up, right? And you know, he, we were like, alright, let's chill next time I'm in LA and all that shit. The nigga, um, he the nigga was like, yo, come to the city, we'll motherfucking we'll get down, you know, niggas will have a good time, we'll go in. Did that nigga stop? No, he's still going. But um, he was like, yo, come to the town and you know, we'll smoke a little bit. So you see, we were talking about some other stuff, and the nigga was like, Oh yeah, you know, we're gonna we're gonna smoke, nigga. And it's like, okay, we're gonna smoke. But the thing is, ice. This nigga is a pussy when it comes to edibles. Ah, <sighs> It's, it's despicable. I don't like that. <laughs> Ice, I'm trying to go ham during this trip. And he, you can't be a bitch about edibles. The thing is, I don't know what kind of rules preside over my man Ice Poseidon streams, but over here, we don't back down from a challenge. I, I thought you boys already knew this. That's part of the, that's part, oh, we're gonna dent the universe in our own special way, nigga. <laughs> so wait a minute. So we don't trust edibles? No, fuck that, fuck that. No, fuck that. Edibles, while they can hit you like a truck out of nowhere, but it's almost like a surprise factor. When you take an edible, you do not know when that bitch is gonna kick in. It could happen in 30 minutes, it could happen in three hours. The thing is, is that they, they, in Cali, they got some shit there. So what we have to do is convince this nigga Ice Poseidon to take an edible with Etika. <laughs> edible with Etika. <laughs> He's gonna be like, nah, I don't fuck with no edibles, homie. <laughs> get that nigga an edible. Get that nigga, get that, tell that nigga to take an edible with Etika. Go into his stream, tell him to take an edible with Etika. No smoke. Edible all day. <laughs> edible all day, bro. I'm not, I don't, I'm, t I'm not hearing it. You can't, oh, what the fuck is this nigga doing? No, I'm good, thank you, sir. What is he doing? 
Yo, finish that burger. Well, I'm gonna put his link there. Tell him that he. Okay, so he's doing an edible right now, technically speaking. Because he's got the motherfucking. <laughs> he's got this edible hamburger. That thing barely looks edible. Tell that motherfucker that he's gotta take an edible with edible. All right. Tell that motherfucker. <laughs> don't bitch it out, Ice. I don't wanna hear about smoke. I don't wanna hear about drink. No. <laughs> he's going in with me. I think he had a bad experience. Did a nigga like fuck him up the ass or something when he took a head or something? Yeah, Boy, I'm telling you, when I pop up in Vegas, dog, there's yeah. no excuse. You, oh shit, <laughs> motherfucker got Greek with him. Uh, Why the fuck is this nigga there? Why he ain't in the UK? What the fuck? They're at the Heart Attack Grill. These niggas are about to die. I ate there once. We were hallucinating. Deception saying. Also, take a look at this link here. Well, I want to hear if this nigga. If we can get him to admit to take it out of him. Can we? He's already, he's already fucked up. This nigga's already fucked up. <laughs> he said that nigga's fat as shit. Yo, that place was fucking crazy though. You know what? Look at the message across the image. It seems like he's too busy being a fucking fat fuck right now. <laughs> I mean, and the place that you're eating at. Um, me and a couple of my other friends, when we were in Vegas, we ate there too. The problem is that it it basically promotes high cholesterol, super fatty food. So when you're in there, you can just feel the diabetes running through you. And it's so overwhelmingly greasy and disgusting. I'm telling you, it like completely ruins every kind of taste or flavor that the meat or the burger may have. There's no vegetables on that bitch. Look at how disgusting that shit is. It's fucking, it's a, it's a monster. It's absolutely fucking gross. Well, she wasn't gross. But I mean, you know what I'm saying though, right? I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, if you want to die, Go to the Heart Attack Grill in Vegas. It will fuck your shit up. I'm telling you that much. But you know what? It seems like Ice is a bit preoccupied with his meal. So for now, we're just going to focus on um, getting into trouble like we were originally planning. With the stream now being adults only, I feel like it's time for us to do something crazy. <sighs> All right. We have a couple of links from individuals who kindly, um, kindly... <laughs> niggas, are, niggas already. Oh, with Etika. Ice, you gotta take an edible with me, bro. No bullshit. Nigga, you taking this edible bro. with me though? Stop playing games. Thank you, dude. I, I fucking love you, bro. You're what the fuck is a host? The homie, dude. We're gonna hang out in about a week's time when you get here, so that's gonna be sick. As no, we're not just gonna hang out. Say you're gonna take that edible. Edible with Etika, bro. Take that edible. Homie, dude. Are you gonna take it? I love him, man. We're gonna fucking do some shit. We're gonna fuck. We're gonna train a bitch together first. <laughs> we're gonna train a bitch. Yeah, we're, gonna, <laughs> we're gonna train a bitch with him together. What the fuck? We're gonna fuck some girl with him, me and him. Dude, together in the same room. Like, like, all right, well, fuck it. Yeah, you can best stay in the corner. I like. I, I, this like this nigga's gonna be in the corner. Him. Okay. Yeah. All right. As long as he's taking the Eddie. As long as he's uh, taking that Eddie. This nigga is so fucked up that he's drunk right now. He's gone. Like th 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 that's just fucking disgusting. <laughs> that's fucking crazy. All right, so as you guys just heard it here, I'm gonna be having a, a, a threesome with Ice Poseidon in LA in a few days. So <laughs> let's um maybe I should have that shit pop up on the stream too, bro. God damn. <laughs> Greek is a nasty human being. I think they all are. We all are nasty. At the end of the day here, aren't us as a species disgusting in our own right? <laughs> it's kind of true, you know? <sighs> Wait a minute. Oh, man. Wait a minute. Okay, so we got... Nuke okay, so a motherfucker just hit me up talking about... Well, I, I don't know. Maybe I won't read that one. That looks like a private message or whatever. But, hey, should be interesting. Um, the Skeleton King saying, I'm in the midst of collecting all the most fucked up shit I can find on YouTube. Well, you know what? I'm ready. Boys, are you ready? It's time for the gauntlet. No more games. Turn this fucking light off. If you are built for it the same way that I am, then you shouldn't have any oblig- You shouldn't have any, any hesitation with this. Join me. Are you guys ready? My friends, we are the audience that encompasses a part of the dark side of YouTube. We aren't the faces, we are the ones who are in the back. We don't get promoted. We don't see the benefits, we don't go to the VidCons. We're not the ones that get the shine. But you know what we are? We're the backbone, because without the darkness, you can have no light. Therefore, let us embrace what we are. These motherfuckers out here, putting putting all these um, diss tracks, well, I mean, the diss tracks are kind of on the dark side of YouTube too, but I mean, you know, it's like, it sickens me sometimes to see how 
cheery and sappy and body positive. It's every now and then you need a little bit of chaos. And I feel proud in saying that that's something that we completely encompass. Guys, I don't know if you agree. I don't know if I sound like I'm a fucking psychopath right now or if I'm about to go on a fucking murderous rampage. But one thing I'll just say right now is I'm happy to be in this position. We are going to embrace the darkness tonight, my friends. We are going to be shaped by it. Molded by it. <laughs> we aren't going to see the light of day until we are men. <laughs> and even at that point, it will be blinding. <laughs> Luke Mama says, adults only. Let's do something crazy. YouTube links, we got a lot of links popping into the stream tonight. Donators, all of you are MVP status for sending these links to us. I'm going to open the links up one by one, and we're going to see for ourselves how bad they are. I, I just hope it doesn't go too over the line. I mean, I know we're the dark side of YouTube, but like, there's dark and then there's just fucking, like, evil. <laughs> I don't know, man. I, uh, but these are YouTube links. They can't be, they can't be like, you know, super bad, right? All right, let me make sure I have my stream here just in case anything goes down. If the stream goes down, if it's taken down by YouTube, I can see it right there and I can know to delete it ASAP. Um, Magician Spooktician, thank you. I took a banned network. No, 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 no one's getting banned tonight, bro. I just want to make sure if, you, if, if you're not ready for this, now's the time to leave the stream, all right? We're probably going to do a little 50-50. We're going to be finding certain things to get in trouble with. Are y'all ready? My room is already dark as my soul. Let's go. Well can't say it any better than that all right we have a link coming in here from uh from my keys my keys i had yours and then we also had the skelly king he said i'm in the midst of collecting the most fucked up stuff on youtube here we go i'm gonna send this to you the skelly king all right oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no okay 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 instantaneously i see the title of this video and it makes me feel uncomfortable right now we have uh the gauntlet. This is, you know what? Here's the thing. If we are able to watch this stuff and like not bat an eyeball, then we should be able to be stronger than almost anything. We'd be able to take on any challenge. This wouldn't be able to phase us. This is going to be bad. You don't want to be here for this. This is not like a, oh man. All right. The first video that we have here coming in from Skella King, who said he collected some fucked up shit is this nail extraction part three. What happened to parts one and two, bro? I don't think that this is too explicit to be shown on camera, but this is definitely too explicit for the heat. I get the heebie-jeebies just thinking about this. We don't even, the video is not even age restricted here. I broke the tip of my finger when I was moving into college. About a week later, it started to smell like fish food. So I decided to take the nail off to make sure it wasn't infected. Part three of three, 77,000 views, 184 dislikes. Good. Good Kamui. The more you say that shit, the more you fucking bother me. This is not good. This is fucking gross. All right, I know I, I just went on a huge speech saying how about how, how ready I am, but I'm not ready for this. This isn't safe for life. Should I even show this on camera or should I just... All right, I'm not even going to... I don't think I'm going to subject you guys to this. I have it open right here. I'm about to watch this on my own. I don't want to show you guys. This is just a fucking gross out. Small yapper. Stream mood right now. I'm ready for it. I'm built for this. No, 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 no. I can beat this. I can beat this. I'm better than this. No, if I can endure this gross out, then that means I'll have the mental fortitude to take on challenges like this or even worse in the future. You know what? It's time to reinforce myself. I grew up with stuff like this. <laughs> oh, God, no. No, nigga, no. Don't show us. Don't be a pussy. I, I'm glad that people are leaving the stream right now because this is not fucking safe right now. I'm glad people are leaving. We have uh, 11,000. Leave the stream. If this is not your cup of tea, I don't want you to see me in a fucked up way. <laughs> You're going to see me in a fucked up way. But if this isn't your cup of tea, tonight's a fucking gross out kind of night. Show it, you pussy. Small Yapper, thank you. Stream mood right now. I'm going to check out that link later on, Small. I have a fucking don't matter. Fucking Christ, that was loud. Future Melody with a $75 major massive donation. Thank you, man. He says, long time streamer, first time donating. I've got work in the morning, so I got to bounce. But you keep doing your thing, my boy. I'll catch you another time, Space Cowboy. Wait a minute, future. That's a big donation. Before you go, my friend, take a shot with me. 
let's take a shot in celebration for things to come for the success that we've been facing ourselves. I mean, you know, the fact that we're doing a stream and we have everybody in here and people are having a good time. I was sleepy earlier. I don't know if you guys are able to tell that, but the energy that you guys give me, as long as you feed me energy, give me the power, give me coal, put coal in my engine, I'll keep moving for you guys. We're gonna do a gross out. Well, we're not gonna do this all night, but you know, we'll just do this one instance of a gross out maybe, because I, I don't know how much of this shit, this shit I can take. But Future Melody, thank you. We're gonna take a shot together, you and me. Hopefully you got your cup ready. Are you going to sleep, bro? Um, He says he has work in the morning. He's gonna bounce for sleep, okay. But keep doing your thing. Yo, before you go, bro, make sure you do, have some fun with me, man. Let's, let's have a good time together, all right? Well, I'm gonna have a good time. I'm gonna have a horrible time. I'll see your ass in the morning. Ah, uh, I'm not ready. No, 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 I am ready. I'm strong, bro. I can take it. I can take it. That's nothing. We're good. Are you guys ready? I'm out. All right. Here we go. This is a five-minute video. I'm not watching the whole five minutes of this. My I'm only going to World Chew with $50 as a donation saying, here is the winner of Kahoot. It's you, Attica. That's... <sighs> that Kahoot... I'm really gonna try to look into seeing if there's a replacement website. If you know of a replacement, email me, guys, please. Lil Chu also says, this is 50 going right into your PayPal. I won the Kahoot. I feel like a failure because I wasn't able to actually, I wasn't even able to actually play it, but you know what? I'm gonna find an alt. Trust me, this is not gonna be the end of quizzes with Etika. The EATs will survive and advance themselves. Also, I'm turning 21 on December 18th. Oh, late birthdays always suck. But you know what? At least you can have a... No, no, that's even worse because when you get a present, it'll be for both Christmas and your birthday. So you don't get the double. Yeah, no, you you, you, you get one. Anyways, besides those 1,000 little kids are making extra accounts to... Besides, those 1,000 little kids are making extra accounts to rejoin. Yeah, I think they are. I'm stalling? Oh, God. Little Chew, you see them calling me a stall master out here? Little Chew, they think I'm stalling. Thank you for your donation, though, man. Uh, damn, I've been kind of skipping shots on the $50 ones because I know these, but that's a lot. Uh, that's a lot of money. Uh, you know what, Little Chew, you're so cool. Okay, Little Chew, you're cool as fuck. You're cool as fuck. We're going to take one final shot for Little Chew, and then that's going to be it. Because, I mean, I, I kind of owe you to watch the anime Yay. anyways, but... All right, Little Chew, this is it. Not even a full one. This is the last shot. Yo, Freshy Jazzy. I'm so delaying. I, I, I'm, as I look, you have to understand. This is on my screen right now. The more I look at this, the more dissuaded I get. Do you really? Okay. One, before we, before we do this, why don't we do something that's more lighthearted, and then we do the fucked up shit? In fact, we could alternate it. Something lighthearted, something fucked up. Don't they have those try not to laugh challenges? Maybe we'll do one of those, and then we'll look at the nigger do the nail extraction part three. So, you know, let's, let's try that. I'm going to look up a try not to laugh challenge. You guys can keep giving me fucked up links. <sighs> Trust me, all the donations that came through with the fucked up links, I have them here. I'll be able to click them. Freshy Jazzy saying, I mean, shit, nigga. I might be 19, but uh, if you're about to help me cop that totally real ID, then I'm going to be up in that fucking party. Hold on, Jazzy. Bro, no, 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 no. I can't, I can't condone that, dog. You're underage. We can't have you inside of my party, which is going to be filled with alcohol and narcotics. No, there's no way in hell, bro. But you know what? You'll still, we'll have you in the party. You just can't engage in any of those substances. As long as you stay away from those. I'll make sure your ass don't touch any of that shit. Because, you know, you should only be doing that when you're a full-grown adult. I honestly didn't do anything until I was 22. So, um, Original Electric saying, social meetup. SoCal meetup. Legit, I'll drive there ASAP. I'm going to be at TwitchCon, bro. I might host a meetup. I might actually put a video up and be like, yo, I'm going to meet with niggas. But we'll see, though. I don't want to start a fucking... A potential rampage that's one of the reasons why i haven't done it yet because i know if we have like over 100 people in one area shit will be crazy and if i make a video saying hey i'll be here i don't know they might be only five people that show up or they might be like 500 i mean i'm not trying to toot my own horn here but i'm just saying that the potential chance is there for there to be over 500 people ready to fucking meet me and shit and that would shut the block down so we'll see but i think this might be the first time i do it i'm gonna take the shot though for my man Lil Chu. it's nothing to me Obviously, it's nothing. And now, let me look this up, though. Try not to laugh challenge. I know there's a lot of these videos that are older. But I don't think this is going to. All right, we have cat videos. Uh, try not to laugh. I mean, I'm seeing a lot of Vine videos here. 
talking about trying not to laugh. These vines are fucking... I don't know if these are the ones that we want to actually see. Like, come on, bro. Are these the ones? You gotta do something fun and then do something, like, crazy. Adrian Fahrenheit Tepez, again. Wait a minute, no, I, I saw... Oh, no, no, I saw your name in the list before, but... This is, this is your first time donating, but I saw your name earlier on the list. He says, this is my first time donating, but I've been meaning to for a long-ass time. I sponsored you earlier, too. Thank you, bro. I'm sorry I didn't see it. Keep up the quality shit, my boy. And if you want some fucked up shit, let's dive in Second Life. Isn't that like a video game where you can pretend that you are someone else? I don't know if I'm crazy about that kind of stuff, but... And would it even be fucked up? Although I know that there's some dark themes in that game. Like, there's murder and, you know, like all this other fucked up shit. You laugh, you lose. All right, let me try that. You laugh, you lose. Man, this is some fucking normie mainstream shit. I'm looking for the real shit, bro. I want something that's gonna actually gonna make me laugh. This shit looks fucking baby soft. Mark shit, market shit at thumbnails. What's that render? What the fuck? I don't know. Niggas need to send me a fucking try not to laugh video. You may like this, but please watch the whole video. Wait, you may like this, but please. Watch the whole video. This came from KJ. Who the hell is KJ? So, Etika went home with a bum in his bum. I already saw this video. <laughs> it's pretty old, actually. Yeah, I saw this. My video. Dick! But thank you, though, man. My dick! Hold on, Anna Cross saying, "I understand you missed my first donation the first time, so I'm going to ask you again. Do you want to get grapefruited? Don't make me ask a third time. This is probably old, Anna." I mean, the grapefruit thing is like from 2000 and now this is my yeah, bonus. Is, but you know, I mean, it's still a funny ass video. It's definitely. Um, I remember watching this way back, and it was like, "What the fuck, nigga?" I mean, but the thing is, this technique would fuck up a nigga because if the if the juice gets inside of his dick hole, then it's game over. Have you ever had citrus juice inside of your piss hole? It, it's absolutely devastating. I mean, I, I was in a position where it happened once. Don't ask me how. Okay, I'll tell you. I was masturbating with a grapefruit at one point after seeing this video years ago because I thought it might feel good and it turned out to be a goddamn mistake. But hey, I learned my lesson. <laughs> and listen, sometimes you can't tell me. Listen, you dudes want to judge me so much. I know y'all motherfuckers must have done some crazy shit when masturbating too, all right? Let's be real with each other here. All right, I, I was curious. After this, I, this video came out when I was like 16 or something. So, I mean, hey, Anna, thank you though. Um, for the heads up on this one, I really do appreciate the donation. I wish I was in the position to take more shots for celebration purposes with you guys, but right now is not the time. Here's the thing. I'm looking at mainstream YouTube for ways to make me laugh. Mainstream YouTube can't make me laugh. The only thing that we can do now is deal with this. Let's watch this extraction. Ah, 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 ah. Oh God, I can't watch this. I can't watch. Oh my God. 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 Please, please, please. No. Oh my. No, 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 no. Stop. Stop the video. I don't know about this one, guys. It's like the anticipation. He didn't even move it yet, but it's like, oh, damn it. I can feel it. <laughs> Why can I feel it? This is fucking horrible. Oh, the chat. Chat, I'm fucking, I'm fucked up. I can't. Chat, I'm fucked up. Sofa King Coven saying, hey, Etika, also, here's a classic video. A classic? What could be so classic that you have a face like that? Sofa King Coven, thank you. Are you the first time donor? Cha la head cha la. What the hell is this? Oh, cha la head cha la. Hey, this is like the Japanese intro, right? Or no, the Spanish intro? I don't know what language they speak in this song, but this definitely is a classic. You know what? I'm gonna download this. Okay, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. That's a funny video, man. I didn't expect that. It's a good thing I stayed for. Oh! oh, oh. Okay. No, bitch niggas! No, snitch niggas! 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 No, bitch niggas! No, bitch niggas! No, snitch niggas! Oh my god, this is horrible. Cutting. Oh my god, this is horrible. This is horrible. This is horrible. Don't look. You are the man. What is he doing? Why did you do Go to the hospital. Go to the hospital, bro. Just think, if you ever get abducted No bitch niggas. No bitch niggas. 
the no Vietnamese. Mission niggas. I'm a man. Yeah, I can handle this. We can handle this. We are the boys. We are the Joy Con boys. We can handle this. This is nothing for us. We can take this. I have the fortitude, the mental strength to bear through. Mr. Midas, thank you. Is Subway catering? I don't want to think about food right now, Midas. No, we're strong. We can take it. Oh! He put the blade part under. Doesn't it hurt? Good. Isn't there a pain? Matik Paolo saying, Etika, you think you can get me out of here that easily? Fuck no. I'm 14 and I'm here to chill with my nigga. Let's, wait, fuck a chill stream. Let's get lit. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> this nigga's a monster. <laughs> He's a monster, bro. Yes, yes, we're here to get lit, but I don't know. Maybe this is getting kind of fucked up. <laughs> What the fuck? Why are we doing this? This is so bad. Why are we subjecting ourselves to this? This is so... <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. The sponsors are like, come on, bro. Lady Zidon says, I have really low pain tolerance. How about we don't? <laughs> this is so fucking crazy. <laughs> this is just disgusting. I don't think there's any benefit to this. It's fucking gross. I'm trying to sit here telling myself, like, I'm, oh, yeah, I'm enduring. Like, no, nigga. This is fucking horrible. We're just watching gore. Good. <laughs> Ivan City saying, Yo, Etika, since we're an 18 plus stream now, you should definitely check out this Tentacion Look at Me video that a fan made for a contest. Uh, X Tentacion Look at Me video that a fan made for a contest. So, this is like a submission or something? Vimeo.com. XXX Tentacion Look at Me explicit. This is mature. What the fuck is this? All right, let's chill with the gore. I don't think gore is necessary. That's just distasteful, bro. I'm trying to... I was really trying to justify it as if the shit was like, whatever, we can deal. No, that's just shock content. It's just like, ugh. It's a fucking nail. I can't watch that. It's gross. Ugh, you see the gangrene? No. It's not... I can't, dude. I'm sorry. If it's just straight up gore, unless it's like... Unless it's like the gauntlet challenge, but even then, ah. Uh, uh, yeah, like, it's just every fucked up shit. No, no, no. I can't. It's so nasty. Etika, it's not adults only. It's 13 plus. Really? What the fuck do you mean by that? Okay. Let me see. What, what is in here? Hey, I like bitch who is your mess. What is in here? Whoa, what the my dick in my pants. Wow, there's a dick right there. Hey, she kicked me out of life, bro. What the hell? What kind of shit am I looking at here? This is some... Yeah. What is this? Hey. Well, you know what? We're, we're adults only right now. Yeah. Hey. This is very uncomfortable yeah. for me. Hey. Yeah. 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 Hey. What is this, bro? I feel like a dick's gonna pop hey. up when he says. Hey. Hey. I like bitch who is your mess. Hey. Can't keep my dick in my pants. Hey. My bitch don't love me no more. Hey. Huh? She kicked me out of life, bro. Hey. I give her this year, man. This is some satanic shit. Look at my wrist about that. Just got a pound of the booth. But that shit straight to the booth. Who made this video? She said, one fuck, bitch, I do. You put a gun on my mess. I put a hole in your parents. I just got lean on my soobies. I got a Uzi, no Uzi. Follow me. Look at me. Wow. This is. Look at me. It's well done, but it's like, what the fuck? Fuck on me. Yeah. Look at me. Fuck on me. Look at me. Fuck on me. Look at me. Fuck on me. My dick. Hey. My dick. Whoa. This. It's a good thing I'm not high watching this. Gango? Tell you fuck nigga, pull me up. Pipe up. Hot Sam. Excuse me. Hot Sam. <laughs> Fun fact. Same day you tweeted about Seek for Alpha. What? Hold hey. on a second. I'm gonna read that in a second, Hot Sam. What kind of demonic? Got like three bitches or more, man. Skid on your members and four head. Don't want your pussy, just one head. Look at me, fuck on me, look at me, fuck on me, look at me, fuck on me, look at me, yeah, hey, look at me, fuck on me, look at me, fuck on me, look at me, fuck on me, look at me. Wow. I feel like this should have been the video. That video is insane. What the fuck? Nigga got porn up here. Wow. But this video is insane though. The editing is ridiculous. 
props on the editing, bro. That is fucked up. Whoever the hell... Gabriel? Gabriel Chigon? What a fucking video. That was artistic as hell. Good. Real good. Story behind this video. It's my own take on Look At Me. I started making this back when he was in jail. About three weeks ago, X announced a contest for the best Look At Me video, and I won. Yeah, you definitely did win. This shit was fucked up. That was the most insane video I've watched. I think that was more trippy than the fucking... Then the, the, the that, that's definitely more trippy than Playboy Cardi shit. Magnolia? Wow. I'm impressed, actually. As wild as that was, the porn was uncensored. Yeah, it was uncensored, but I mean, you know, we're age restricted right now. I mean, we weren't looking at it for like porn content to like get niggas off. It was just like a creative piece that had a bunch of shit. It was like a creative purpose. It's like it's like Robin Thicke when they had um that hey, 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 and all those girls that they titties out on YouTube and pussies out and shit. It's, it's like stuff like that, artistic. Then Ten Guru saying, can you at least read the story or Chuck or Cheese before you get fucked up by the YouTube links? All right, so we're going to read the story of Chuck E. Cheese. Then Ten Guru, I'll entertain this, man, but I don't know what the fuck you... The story of Chuck E. Cheese. Once upon a time, a little mouse moved into the St. Mar Mariana's orphanage. He loved to play games, but most of all, he loved learning to play music. Good. He loved the song Happy Birthday. Because Chucky was an orphan, no one knew when his birthday was. So he never had a birthday party of his own. This made Chucky sad. But not for long. Because so many kids at the orphanage, there was a birthday party almost every week. I'm not reading this fucking shit! It's TLDR, bro! Nintenguru! What are you putting me through? Why, am I, why is this even a thing? What is this? He won a pawn tournament like one day. What? What is this man trying to subject me to? What is he trying to subject the stream to? Is he psycho? Pikachu want that Diga saying, I want to be scared for my life, my boy. Well, you know, you kind of have the same vibe as I do with this kind of shit. You know, it's more like a, yeah, try to fucking freak me out. But it's like that, 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 that nail shit was just disgusting. That was just like made to shock i don't know it loses taste at that point what the fuck i'm skimming through it now i'm not reading this shit on stream this shit's gonna make me lose viewers Good. bro nintanguru you gotta understand that this shit is not fucking copacetic with the stream whatever man my motherfuckers can screen cap this shit you can screen cap it i don't want to fucking deal with this chucky e. cheese shit anymore god damn it you're gonna really make it so i just go there and record a video of myself in there just so you can be happy motherfucker Dude's bought up this Chuck E. Cheese shit like a million times on the stream now. KJ's saying, hey, Etika, this will soften you up for that gauntlet. You may not, wait, you may like this, but please watch the whole video. I think I already saw this one. KJ, is that your shit? So a lot oh, of yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so getting butt But that was a funny video. Though. All right. Well, you know what? We can keep this shit moving. I was trying to find, let's, 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 let's minimalize the shot content and let's just focus on stuff that's actually fucked up. Etika, my keys, you didn't read my donation? I did read it. It was just... A while after I after you donated that I read it. He said you wasted our time with our iDubs. Wait, no, I did. I, okay, I see it now. He said you wasted our time with the iDubs react re repetition. No, you wasted my time with the iDubs. Y'all niggas are the ones that wanted that shit. I didn't fucking y'all know. Oh, watch it, watch it. It's like, okay, fuck it. Um, with and the fail kahoot. I did waste your time with that. Um, also check out this shit. Give me my speaker. The fuck? Kid rages over what? Kid rages over friend taking his Beats XL pill. What the fuck? It's not fucking funny anymore. You take shit you are. No, no, I've got your fucking three hundred dollar piece of equipment. You fucking run around with it. Is this about to get real? Back, give it back. Stop fucking me! I don't care who's over there. They can fuck right off. He's serious, bro. Give me my goddamn speaker! Oh shit. Oh, he's pissed. Give me my finger! Give me my fucking finger! He's just fucking with him for the sake of the laugh. Why don't you just walk around and get it? Well, let's see. 
<laughs> what the fuck? That's so fucked up. Why would you do this? Why would you do this, bro? Give me my speaker. What an asshole. That's fucked up. But the thing is, is that the guy doesn't understand that freaking out about it is going to make them more inclined to, like, act like jerks, you know? They want reactions. If, you, if you've ever been in a serious situation... Bro, at this point, okay, if I was that dude... If that, okay, here we go. Now, some of you guys may not agree with this opinion, but if you've ever found yourself in a similar situation, and I'm talking about the guy whose speaker is currently being absconded by the um, other guy with the red shirt. Oh, they all got red shirts on. You got to knock him out. <laughs> like, if you want to be taken seriously, as fucked up as it seems, they're willing to go that far to fuck with you just for the sake of getting a laugh. Like, I would get the initial laugh and then give it back to the guy. But I mean, like, and I wouldn't even go that far. I wouldn't even do that. But I mean, if he's still doing it at that point, like, the motherfucker has your shit in his hand. And he's still holding on to it. And bro, okay, and he finally let it let go. Okay, so I mean, that's good. So you didn't have to resort to that. But if they, I've been in that situation before here in Brooklyn where it's like, it gets serious. And these dudes are like, oh, no, 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 fuck that. No, no, we're not giving this shit back to you, fuck that. You have to knock someone out. It's, it's the only way sometimes. It's unfortunate that there are some barbaric, asshole, moronic, like, niggas that do that. I mean, don't do it if there's a whole squad. But if there's only one of them... I'm sorry, you, you gotta chin check him. You have to. You have to sometimes, to the ignorant, show dominance through physical means. And as caveman as that might seem, for a lot of people, especially those who grow up in broken households with parents that are abusive or something, getting physical is the only way to get through. Don't do it if there's a squad, but if there's one of them, clean him up real quick and he'll know not to do this shit again. A lot of people think that, oh, when you attack, it makes them retaliate later or something else might happen and it might get worse. No. No. A lot of the time, the people that have that same mentality to do such acts are actually pussy niggas. I've done it plenty of times and got respect afterwards because, you know, they're like, oh, okay, my bad. You know, I didn't know it was that serious or whatever. There was a, there was a time in high school where this dude in the lunchroom would constantly throw bread at my head. And it was like the little breads that they give you, the little buns, like the little the little White Castle shit. He would always throw it at my head in the lunchroom. And whenever I said, yo, man, that's not cool, he'd be like, yo, I was just joking, bro. Don't take it so seriously. It's just a joke. And everybody would laugh it off. And it was like, oh, he's just joking. It's okay. So I was like, all right. It was a joke. Whatever. But it still pissed me off that he was doing it. And so one day, he had done it like three times in the session. He had good aim. He hit me right in the back of my head. And I was like, oh, okay. And I don't know what happened that day. I'm not trying to sound like I went Super Saiyan or whatever, but it was just, it, it wasn't even a bad day for me. I had, I, had, I had been making out with my girlfriend in the morning and you know, I was, I was in a good mood. I, I had like, I, I got like a super good grade on my test. It was at lunchtime and you know, I, everything was all hunky dory and he did it three times. And the third time everybody was just laughing and shit like, oh, you know, that's so funny. His aim's so good. And it's like everything went blank in my head. And it's like everything just... just like, you know, like... It, you, you know those, like, Zai Wardo memes were just... Doom. Like, that's what it felt like in my head. All reason and logic, I didn't even anticipate this happening. It just all went white. And I stood up. And the thing that made it crazy is the way I walked towards him, it didn't look like I was going to confront him. It just looked like I was going to throw something away in the garbage can. Or talk to a peer of Good. mine at the other lunch table. I just walked calmly. And as I walked past the row that he was sitting in. Because you know how those lunch tables are. They're long. And you have to walk, you know, past the side of them. I just turned casually. And walked towards him. And I took my bag off. So I guess it seemed like I was about to sit down. And as I was in the process of taking off the bag. Man, I'll never forget this shit. I will never forget this shit. And the crazy part is that Ben, Ben wasn't in school that day. So, I mean, he doesn't, he, 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 he can't reminisce. But there were some people that saw that shit. If I bought out somebody from high school and I told them about it, they remember this shit. I had my book bag on, right? And I took it off casually. And I just made it seem like I was going to sit down. And as I was literally mid, like, putting it on the ground, I just dropped it. And I kid you not, the the most insane 
punch of my life just fucking I, I'm telling you, if I tried to replicate that now, I, I don't think it would be possible. Because I used to live weights back then, and it just, boom! I hit that dude so fucking hard, he was on the ground, laid out for like 10 seconds. And it, it just, I don't know why it, it happened like that. It just fucking snapped, everything went, I'm telling you, there was no logic in my brain. I had no thoughts. It literally just happened. I didn't say I gotta prove myself or like I need to retaliate or there has to be some kind of way I can like, you know, get, I, it just came out of me and it's boom. And the dude just, motherfuck, man. I'm telling, uh, and, and ever since, he never did it again. <laughs> he never did that shit again. It was the most insane yeah. shit. And there was another instance that something similar to that happened too. Because there was someone else that saw and at some point later in high school, they were like throwing pens at me or whatever. And you know, it's like, okay. Well, it wasn't as serious as like the, the, the buns from the high school lunchroom. But I mean, the dude was throwing pens. And at one point, I was just sitting there in class in the homeroom. And then I got up. And ben was there for this one. Ben remembers this shit. And I literally just flipped the fucking table. And I stormed out of the room. And everybody in the room was like, what the fuck? And they all, yo, wait, what are you doing? Well, they said, that, yo, Daz, what are you doing? And I, I was like, I fucking rushed. I rushed at that nigga's room. I busted that door open. And my teacher, my homeroom teacher, he came, yo, what are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? And I was like, oh, I, 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 I was, <laughs> it was fucking crazy. Sometimes you gotta snap. Every now and then, like you gotta snap. You My gotta God. send a message, and it's so wrong that you gotta do so. You would wish that society could just be. No, if you're going to a school in the hood, especially, you gotta snap sometimes. It's it's just a fact of society. How many people? How many people in here have had similar situations? Because the thing is, is that I I never get mad about shit. I never like react strongly to things. I always am lighthearted about everything. I mean, look at the way I run my channel and my streams. I mean, I don't take shit seriously, but. If you consistently annoy me or persist at something and it constantly comes out and it's like, it builds up. I don't let it be known. Like, you could piss me off right before the point of breaking and I'll still be like, ah, whatever, it's okay. But I mean, you know, don't do it again. I'll I'll keep a calm demeanor and I, that's, that's the thing that, like, is misleading. Because I could be ready to snap at any time and I'll just be like, no, I, I, I'll express my discomfort, but I'll do it in the most rational way possible. And if you go over that one time, I mean, th but anyways... <laughs> Sorry to, I, I went on that fucking long ass story for no reason, and I fucking missed like a million donations. Sorry about that, boys. Hopefully you understand the position I'm in. That shit is uh, kind of crazy. Hatsuma again. He says, "Hey man, I'm your creep slash weird dealer. You click this, and you will enter a new reality of dark tube. Look at the recommended videos." Okay, now that sounds kind of interesting. Also. My other donation, Good. check that one out. My bad, bro. Hotsma, I'm gonna check that one out in a second. Map says, my dude Claypot dropped 40 bucks already to show you his fan art. And the moment you almost looked at it, you got distracted. Come on, boy, take a second and look back. My bad, bro, it's not anything personal. Clay, you understand what I'm doing out here. I'm, I'm entertaining the motherfuckers out here. I'm entertaining myself, but I mean, I'm, I'm gonna look back in a second. Don't worry, I missed out on a bunch of these things, but let me see here. Uh... We had this video from Hotsma. We had Clay's art here. Let me see. Where was it at? Where was it at? I'm going to go back. Damn, you niggas are donating a lot of money. I think it might be. Do, do I have to like raise the minimum again, bro? These motherfucking $20 donations. Motherfuckers are not supposed to be donating that much. 20 is supposed to be limiting this shit. It's crazy. That's, a, that's such a good problem to have, man. Thank you, guys. That's a very flattering problem to have. Where was Clay's donation at? I'm losing these shits. I'm fucking lost in these shits now. Jesus Christ, where the fuck did the donation go? How many times did niggas donate? Was it, was it, okay, he says, hey man, I'm the dude super epic clay. Okay, I saw that one. And then where the hell did it go? Okay, there we go, there we go, I found it. My bad, dudes. All right. Oh, shit, oh, he drew Cuphead yeah. with the Joy-Con boy shirt. I see you. Wait a minute, Clay. Wait, am I still following you, bro? Oh, no, I didn't follow you. I never followed you. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Well, I mean, he's cool people, though, so I'm going to follow you now. I'm surprised I didn't follow you before. I got you, though. You know, I'm very, very strict with my followers, so I mean, maybe I just randomly 
unfollowed you at one point. I think I did follow you at one point. Mavera says, hey, man, real shit. I had to square up on a few niggas back in the day. As soon as I did, they stopped bothering me. It's a fucking fact, man. You, you gotta. These motherfucking cavemen ass. These motherfuckers just don't understand, bro. And I don't want to hear that it's because you live in the hood. Man, I know plenty of hood niggas that just have human decency to understand boundaries. And the thing is, is that there's some people out there that just don't get when they're pushing it. You know, they don't have the empathy to understand the other person's position and how they feel in it. And it's like, a, it's a genetic thing. You just, some people just don't have it in them. Me personally, I, I, I don't know if I have a lot of empathy, but I know for a fact that when I see somebody going through something painful, my heart starts to hurt a lot. And especially if there's somebody that's close to me, it makes it like, damn, like, oh, I heard that empathy is also the reason why, like when we watch videos, like the, remember the... Oh shit almighty, what the fuck? Who oh, 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 fuck? Oh, wow. Two hundred dollars coming in. What's this man's name? Wow, that's a lot of Jesus Christ. I love this part. I love this. My fucking dick! I love that part. <laughs> A cornosto, a a cornsto earth with two hundred dollars in one donation. Is there an acorn emote in the chat? God damn, this man said I'm a longtime fan, but first time donator. Man, how many times have we seen that combination of words used over here? A lot of people have been in this dude's position, but $200? That's a few, bro. That's only a few. He says, uh, I mean, people, um, I stayed, wait, I came for the games and I stayed for the memes. What games are you talking about? I don't play no fucking video games. You know this as well as I do. He says, uh, the laughs and the feels also along the way. Memes, laughs, and feels. Here's to a spoopy Halloween. Hold on a second. My boy Acorn with $200, bro. He's wildin'. He's wildin'. I see you out here, man. There is an Acorn emote in the chat. Boy is balling out right now. Thank you so much. Generosity like that is honestly, you know, not even... It, it's rare to see in the world, but in a stream, in this stream, for some reason, it's a very consistent thing to see people donate in the same ways that you have. And it shows me that there's just such beauty in humanity and the things that people love. They're fear. willing to go all in for stuff that they believe in and care about. And I'm glad that I'm on the receiving end of that empathy from you, my friend. I was just talking about empathy, and now you're showing us a great showcase of it. Thank you for that, Maycorn. I really do appreciate it. The stream appreciates it. Chat appreciates it. Of course, like always, it goes back into the stream. You know, not into hookers. Well, well actually... Your donation's not going to go into the stream. It's going to go into that wild party and that stay that I'm having in LA with all these wild niggas with the YouTube shit. That, that, I'm going to be real with you. That's where it's going to go this time around. But you know that there's a lot of stuff that can happen with that that'll progress the channel as well too. So, I mean, feel good in knowing that that is going to go towards me being able to expand my horizons and um, benefit the YouTube shit to happen even better for me, you know? I think that's good. I think that's good. Don't 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 feel bad, all right? Um, Palm Tree Poppy with $35 saying, I've been waiting for so long. It's not even even funny looking forward to that cuphead and also i was wondering if you could watch this link on stream damn a lot of motherfucking links coming in i see you boys out here though man acorn acorn you know what i said i wasn't gonna drink anymore and i was i was persistent on that but fucking christ man that you're kind of breaking the limits right now 200 dollars donation is nothing to laugh at my friend we are not laughing in your honor we are embracing it we are giving it love we are giving it gratitude and hopefully with contributions like this and motherfuckers that believe things can continue to progress in a positive way for the channel hey man i'm just trying to do more wild shit out here next time things are going to be more organized i feel bad about the kahoot i do i wish it was able to work better i should have done more research and seeing how many people could work in it and how to prevent bots but it's a learning experience things will get better as time goes on here we go acorn are you ready this is this is probably not going to be a good thing for me to do i'm going to get more and more drunk as time goes on but whatever okay ah uh. Should we go to the deep web? I was thinking about it. I saw the comments, of course. It's kind of late. The stream is already adults only. It's 1.58 a.m. A lot of motherfuckers went to sleep. But for some reason, 10,000 of you still have what it takes to rock out with your boy. 
if you are still here, congratulations. You're made out of something different than what those guys who have left earlier have. Well, actually, maybe not. Maybe they're responsible about their lives and decided that going to their job refreshed and awake is better than going there at fucking corpse because you stayed up watching a nigga online stream. But you know what? Even if you are that kind of irresponsible person, I'm glad that you're making my acquaintance. I'm glad that you decided to entertain me tonight because, you know, it, it, it's, it's something. The professional world has so much of influence on us that it makes us forget the things that sometimes we're actually passionate about. You remember earlier when I was streaming Cuphead, niggas like, go to your credit meeting, bro, why are you playing this Cuphead? I still regret putting down that game because I know for a fact I could have I could have came through for the niggas. I could have. But you know, uh, I guess it wasn't meant to be at that point. Still, maybe we should go to the deep web just to add some extra spice to everything. Uh, everything else failed tonight. I was trying to go in with the fucking... Uh, I was trying to go in with the coup, it failed. I really had so many, should I just show you the questions that I had prepared? I really wanted to show you because it's like, oh, uh, well, it, it didn't work. Or maybe we could do the Kahoot now. Maybe there'll be less people so we could actually do the $150 prizes. By the way, thank you, all these donators, man. And Mavera, thank you. Um, Map, he donated, thank you so much. Acorn, he said, happy spoopy Halloween, what's this? I love that Goosebumps theme. Hey! Happy Halloween. Hey, this nigga knows how to move! Hey! Goosebumps. You will be where you're in for a scare. <laughs> I love that song. Scare. It's spooky time, bro. It's spooky time, bro. All right. But you know what? I think it's about time. Fuck it. No delaying. I'm curious to see now. Is there anything that'll be interesting on the deep web for us right now? I don't really have any links prepared or anything, but all right, fuck it. Let's start it up. I'm not scared anymore. I'm willing to start it. Normal start. Boom. Master Rosie donated a comic. We're going to the deep web, bro. Real quick. Just, you know, do not show this message again. Okay. okay cancel that. Let's go. Whatever. Let's see. Maybe we can find something interesting. <laughs> oh shit this is happening so fast bro i don't know if i'm ready but you know what let's just see what happens let's see what happens master rosie thank you what is this link wait why is my shit not working no no, no i have to move this one down and now i'm going to wait what what's going on here target resound what the fuck is that master rosie thank you what's this link this web thing is what? All right, Star Tales. That's the operating system. So what we're gonna do right now, um, if you guys don't remember the process, this is a fake computer that's going to um, it's going to be where we have the deep web shit running from, and then we can actually go to the links on here through this little um, fake machine, so that way it doesn't like because apparently on the deep web there's a bunch of people that are giving viruses and trying to track your location when you have a fake computer like this they can't harm your actual real one so if viruses and shit come in the only thing that's going to get destroyed is this thing all right so let me see here i've heard a lot about this uh red room thing i don't know i'm curious to see what the hell this thing might be deep web site links all right all right Yay. i think i got this thing right here what is the deep web thing okay here we go bam they have a couple of websites here. Uh, deep web links. Boom. You should do a manual upgrade to Tails 3.2. I don't know what the fuck that means, bro. I mean, I don't know. I, fuck you. Who needs to upgrade? They're only going to be here for a few minutes. I don't want to be on here for too long because, I mean, at the same time, 
it is still the deep web and I don't want to get myself into trouble that I could avoid by, you know, actually knowing what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing right now, so let's not push it. I just want to pop on here and see what's up. All right, we're going to make this full screen. Red rooms are fake. Well, let's find some links. Let's find something interesting on here. Let's find something interesting on here. Let's see what happens. All right. So we have a couple. All right, here we go. So I can't really, the thing that makes this a little bit annoying is that I can't copy paste. So I'm going to have to type in the links manually to see what the hell, where the hell we're going to go. But the thing is, is that since I, I, I don't know what the hell I'm looking at right now, all these say are wikis or these are just wikis. All right, so let me type this one in. The first one we have here, I don't know. Maybe I went to this one already. Western Union exploit? What is a Western? How do you exploit the Western Union? What the fuck? Okay, here we go. HTTP. Um, semicolon. A Western Union exploit. Is this something that you can use to manipulate the system? QC. 7IL. O N W P. Um, hold on. We had a, a we have a Colonel McKernel saying Deep Web boys, nigga. I have school tomorrow and I gotta wake up in three hours. But fuck it, Deep Web all night, nigga. I don't know about all night, bro. I'm just like I'm just curious about seeing what happens here. Q wait O N W P V seven seven Q. P7, it's P77Q, PV77Q, okay, IBM.onion, okay, IBM, my dick, oh fuck, my dick, DJ Lennon with another donation, what is up man, like, now, the thing is, these pages will take a little bit of time to load up, because apparently web speed on here is really slow, and that's not even like my own internet speed. It's just like how the deep web works in general. But EJ Lennon says, good night, my boy. I have to go to bed for my internship. And also, you haven't done this in a while. Give the ice cream for your boy. Oh, I don't even have any ice cream in my fridge right now, dog. That shit is empty. I don't have nothing in there. It's kind of like, uh, it, it, I haven't really bought groceries that much since I've moved into this apartment. But I mean, you know, it's, it's whatever. It's not that important to buy groceries. Fuck it. Who needs groceries? Thank you, though, EJ. Really do appreciate you, man. I hope you didn't take any real offense to me fucking joking about how much you scare me. You do scare me, but I mean, it's nothing to be offended about. It's just me being real. <laughs> I'm just telling you how it is. You're a cool dude one way or another, man. I know plenty of people that have been cool and scary as fuck at the same time, so. Hold on. This link is not working. I'm not seeing anything successfully here. Maybe it's, maybe it's broken? That's the thing that makes this crazy, too. A lot of these motherfucking links can come through and wind up not being functional because they've been taken down by the FBI or maybe the website owner just gave up on the website or something like that. Dude, update tails. Why should I update tails? I don't fucking want to update tails. It'll take too long. I'm just here to pop in, pop out. I'm not trying to spend too much time on here, man. I ain't trying to get tracked. All right, I don't think that link is working. So we'll, you know what? Here's the thing. We'll have multiple links going and we'll see what happens. High quality tutorials. All right, so here we go. We have another link here. This one doesn't tell me what it is. This is HTTP. Or maybe we could just go to one of those um links that we had before. Fuck it. The Tor Stack 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 Exchange. Fuck it. I don't know. Does this still work? Oh, this does still work. This is a this is a question and answer site for researchers, developers, and users of Tor. Join them. It only takes a minute. Okay. So this is just like random stuff. This isn't stuff that applies to us, right? This is just stuff that motherfuckers like technical stuff. All right. All right. What about What about those other sites that we went to at one point? There was one that had like a bunch of stuff. Tour check. This is the one that we just went to. Is there like a history tab? I still don't know how this thing works, man. It's been a little while. Wow, it doesn't save history at all. Maybe that's part of the benefits of using the the virtual machine. The fact that links aren't saved because they don't want shit to be easily looked up. They don't want you to have a history on here. It's supposed to be laundered as soon as you close it. All right. 
Damn, I wish I could copy paste these links though. They're so long. Some of these, some of these links I'm looking at here, like I'm looking at a link for the Dark Nexus, and this is like multiple letters long, super complex. Maybe I can copy paste somehow. I mean, I don't know. How, how, how would I do it? Because the thing is, this machine is different from my own machine, so it's not going to copy it and be able to like paste it here. Here we go. Let me see. How would how would this work? Can I do this? Paste? No, it's not because it's from different machines entirely. How would I do this? Maybe I can do this? No, it's not going to work. Here's the link right now. You can see that link right there. But it's not going to go through. Check your email. Check my email. Okay, I'm going to check my email. Boom. I don't know. I'm going to check my email right now, man. If you guys want to send me links, you could either do it through the donation box or the email is better. An alternative for Kahoot. Oh, you guys sent me Kahoot alternatives. Thank you, guys. I'll actually use those later on so I can do this um, $150 prize thing for the Kahoot thing. What the fuck? I know you're not big into Mario, but there's this fan game. Okay. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? All right. I'm trying to pull up... Um... Damn. I wish there was a way to look at this link. Damn it. They take so long to type, but sometimes I feel like I get something wrong. You know, I'm going to try typing in one more. All right, boys? ACTP. E266. AL32. VPUO. RBYG. Slash book mark dot php okay let's see this one does this work some of these might be done hero of trap says hey etika check your dms i sent you a week ago um since i posted my cell phone number call me and i can help you with this deep web shit and also you missed my last donation hero of trap sorry about that bro what was your last one shit i didn't even get to see it wait oh did this work no these, these this one didn't work that's the thing, man. I got to have relevant links. I got to have up-to-date links. These motherfuckers don't be working. That's one of the reasons why the deep web shit is kind of like a motherfucking um, the hidden wiki .org. Oh, that's a that's a, like a default one, right? You know what? Let's try that one. The hidden... The .org sites would work normally on this thing, right? Okay, okay. So you know what? For now, until we find a way to be able to copy-paste links easily... We have to use sites like this, where they're just like huge compilations of a bunch of deep web links. And maybe we could find something interesting on one of these things. I don't know. I mean, maybe yes, maybe no. Kotman. Oh, thank you. Thank you, man. And sorry about missing your donation, Nero Traps. I got to look back. Okay, he said, I'm envious of those fuckers that party in California. And also, here's a you laugh, you lose challenge. And here is a lit here's literal heaven. Marina, not safe for work. All right, I can kind of get a vibe for what that I one might be. don't like internet memes, SpongeBob. You laugh, you lose blood, SpongeBob edition. All right, once we're done with the deep web shit, then we'll go there. But for now, here's where you guys' interaction is actually going to be helpful here. I'm going to try to look through some of these links. Let's try to see if we can find one that looks ex like especially fucked up. Wow, there's a whole Marina board dedicated to not safe for work content. Hero traps, bro. You, 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 you be on some shit, man. This nigga be knowing where the, all the shit is. He be knowing where all the shit is. All right, Etika, you can copy paste. Well, then I'm just a dumbass, aren't I? <sighs> okay. Here we go. So there's a couple of things here. The Onion Wiki. Okay. Um, is there a way to like filter this thing out to see like the most recent stuff? I don't want to see things from 2013. I want to see things from this year. How can we look at the most recent stuff that's been posted on the deep web? A lot of this is just old content. Where's the new shit? Hidden uh, link to, to okay, so let's let's try this one out. People posting the police demo. No, we're not gonna go to jail. We haven't done anything illegal yet. I said yet, like we're going to. No, we're not gonna do anything illegal. We're just here to. This website attempted to extract Canvas data, which may be used. Um, should the Tor browser allow this website to extract that data? Allow in the future. Why not? To browse Onion Deep Web links, install Tor browser. 
from the tourproject.org. Is this safe to do? I don't know if I don't know what the fuck that means, but it says to install something. Oh no, we already installed this. We already have this. And now it says uh, the DuckDuckGo search engine. Okay, marketplace for now. So. All your wiki, a clean clone of whatever. Okay, whatever. Let's let's try this one out. Where is this gonna take us? I'm guessing this is gonna be another compilation of a bunch of fucking links. Stop posting this fucking police shit in the in the chat. All right, we're not going to jail tonight. We're not going to jail, bro. Relax. See, the link didn't even work. A lot of these links don't even work naturally. There's nothing to be like scared of per se. I think. Project Evil. I think we looked at this one before, right? That's silent. My shit. My shit is getting annoying now. Yeah, man. So many of these. You know what? Let's open up a bunch of these. I'm tired of fucking bullshitting around, pussyfooting around with one thing. Let's open up a bunch of these links and see what the hell works out. Right, I'm going to open up this whole list right here. Bam. Now we just wait. They're all loading up, so we'll see what happens, all right? And once we have confirmation on one of these things, we can start exploring. See what the fuck goes down. You fucked up? What did I fuck up? Like, I'm... I'm Tranny... Wait, what? How do I silence this stupid iPhone? There we go. I'm seeing a lot of links sent to me on email now. Well, no, no, this is just like the links I'm being sent. Good. Even... Wait, Hero Trap says you seriously need to call me. I'm not calling you during the stream, nigga, and um, whatnot. I know my way around the deep web. I'm not calling you, nigga. He says uh, I posted my phone number in Twitter DM. So, yeah, uh, don't you don't want another mysterious phone call. I'm not going to call you, bro. <laughs> uh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. OK, one of these websites is working. Apparently. You know, I don't share my phone number like that, bro. But th but thank you for the donation, though, man. It's just, you know, that, that that's a level of privacy that I don't want to fucking broach in this situation. But thank you. I'm going I'm to check out the DMs in a second. I just want to make sure I have these some of these links working. iPhone 7 and 7 Plus. Okay, this is a moderately innocent website. Nothing serious here. Is this where it sells? Why would you need a deep web link to sell iPhones? iPhone 7. With uh, 128 gigabyte, what? okay. Whoa, wait, whoa. iPhone 7 plus 400 US dollars. It's kind of cheap. Wow. Brand new iPhone 7 and 7 plus. All phones are factory unlocked and they work internationally. They're actually kind of cheap. MacBook Pro 2017, limited amounts available. 1500? I mean, 1500 is a lot of money, but that's cheaper than what Apple sells them for. Why, how would they be able to sell? Because I know you can go into the Apple store right now and get an iPhone. Is, is iPhone 7 Plus normally $400? Or would it be if you, walked into the, if you walked into the Apple store right now? How much would you spend for this shit? It's fake? Should be stolen? I'm not interested. I'm just curious because I know Apple be charging ridiculous prices for this shit. And this shit just seems cheap to me. Buy it, no balls. It's probably just a brick. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's probably a scam. How are they selling it for that low? All right, so you look at all those links that we put out there. The shit didn't even respond to us. Maybe if I re refresh like one or two. So what's this? Oh, okay, here we go. Carded store. Type in the following. BQD. Is there anything wrong with me doing this right now? BQD. 9-4-G. Is this probably like a cap the verification or something? Click here to continue. I don't know if this is like... Oh, this is just some stupid website. Why would you need a website like this to sell phones? Can't you do this on the regular net? Unlock cell phones and smartphones. These shits look stolen to me. These shits are definitely stolen. 256 gigs, price from the USA, 425 so they steal these phones? This shit is boring. I'm just going to jerk. Yeah, it's, it's a little boring. I'm not really seeing anything crazy right now. I mean, but they're, they, these are definitely prices that you won't be able to find if you're like shopping at the Apple store in here. 
All right, I'm going to close these for now. Niggas is just selling phones, bro. I guess the only websites that are left up from the FBI are the ones that sell phones. All right, what's this? Safe bets. Fixed matches. Sports betting. Move hundreds of millions a day. <laughs> Great grammar. A sportsman can earn much more money by playing bad a particular day than if he won the tournament. There are several people connected with coaches, athletes, and form a network of information, bribes, favors, and sometimes coercion. Fully organized to fix matches. I work in the industry and have access to part of fix, part of the fixed matches, but it's very rare in these high odds who always offer the odds of 25 are a scam. I offer secure fixed matches with odds from 4 to 60. We're talking Bitcoin now, right? That's a lot of money. And always sell them 24 hours before the game. My prices are not cheap for profitable games. It is valuable and deserves to be paid. I'm taking risks posting this. Here are a couple of my bets. Click on it. Are we talking bets like... So you mean to tell me that some of this shit is really fixed? U.S. Open tennis? This is actually like some serious sports shit. Hockey, Russia. Hockey and tennis. Like we're talking about official teams here? That shit's fucking insane. But I mean, you know, it's whatever. All right. I mean, I kind of had a feeling it was a little bit on the corrupt side. So now we're talking about the U.K. guns. All right. So we had actually seen this website before. A lot of these seem like they are the same build, though. None of them seem like they have like uniqueness when it comes to like how they're put together i don't know i mean i think some of these links are just not going to work we're not prepared for the deep web right now we have to make sure we have things set up for ourselves this isn't going to work yeah man I, I if i'm going to go back to the deep web i have to find something that's going to consistently give me working links a lot of these things are dead. It's just not going to work out. So it winds up being boring. I'm bored right now. I'm bored as fuck watching this shit. This bunch of pages loading with no source or, you know, nothing happens. Yeah. It, for now, if the, the, the best thing that can happen is people send me links that are working. I don't think I'm going to have time to, like, watch all these on stream. I mean, it's getting a little late, but I think for now, yeah, I'm going to probably end the stream. And then I'll come back at you guys later on with more stuff in hand. But it's just right now, it just doesn't feel like there's stuff to look at. It's it's like dead. Everything doesn't work. Good. I don't know why it's so broken. Jack Daniels saying, I sent you an email with a wiki link that has a lot of working links. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute. Is this you, Xavier Lopez? Jack Daniels. Wait, is that you? Links for the... Oh, I just said your name. Fuck, my bad. This shows you five popular links for the deep web. What the fuck are you talking about? This nigga sent me a link to motherfucking white tea. Alright, real funny troll, man. But, you know, it's not giving me what I need. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, Jack Daniels, wait a minute. This is your email. Oh. This is a wiki with a lot of working links. Okay, no, no, no. That, that was somebody bullshitting me. This nigga actually has a real link. But you know what? Let me see here. Actually, let me see here. I'm going to open up my thing one more time. Pause. And let's see how functional this really is. I don't know, man. I mean, the, the deep web shit kind of... Remember the last time we went on here and we found that shit with the little boys in the... Uh, we, we, we found the fucking 4chan-like board and it had the little boys. And he posted a picture that was super recent. Like, when we had watched that... When we saw that picture, it was like of only like a few days before. So we knew it was recent stuff and it was relevant. Shit like that is just... I don't know, man. Like, am I really trying to sign myself up for more of that kind of shit? It's, it's, it's slow, though, right now. It's slow. I'm not really seeing much. Powerfist, thank you. That Daniel's Hero Traps. Again, thank you, bro. I know you donated a lot. I hope you're not pissed at me. But, you know, I just... I can't call you, bro. There's too much shit going on right now. 
All right, we're going to try this one more time. He sent me, Jack Daniels, thank you for your donation, and thank you for sending me that list. He said that this shit has a lot of working stuff, so maybe we'll be surprised here. I'm going to type out your link right now. All right, here we go. Copy and paste this in the Tor browser. Etika, if you want to copy and paste, put it on a Google Drive, Dropbox, or some online service. That's a good idea, bro. As a matter of fact, I think I have Google Keep here. I would just have to log in. I don't know about logging in on the deep web fucking virtual machine, but there are options I could use if I really wanted to. Jack Daniels, man. All right, this is a long link, but he said... When we go to this link, there's going to be a lot of working links. So, I don't know. We're going to try this out. We're only going to deep we're only going to dive just a little bit and see what happens, okay? So, let me type this. Give me a moment while I put this all in, all right? This is https https semicolon uh, blah blah gxa m M J B N U seven U K N A H N G dot onion. Okay, got that part. Slash wiki slash index. Dot PHP slash. All right, let's see. I hope this works. I don't know if that was a J or an I. Was that an I? I think it might have been an I. All right, I'm going to try that. That was an I. Is that it? GXAM BNU7. Okay. It's taking a little while. It's taking a little while. Did he just send me a fucking fucked up link? What if he sent me a link that was like something actually to get my information? I don't know. I don't want to assume that. But remember how we tried to put in the other link and it didn't connect? It just said unable. And this link is taking a little while to load up, but maybe that could be because it's real? I don't know. What the fuck? Why is it taking so long? Hurry up. God damn it. I'm sleeping. I'm bored just doing this. Don't worry. If you guys are bored, I'm bored too. Back out. Leave. Colonel, hey. what the fuck do you mean back out? Is there something wrong with this? Wait a minute. Hatsuma says, hey man, don't stand near a bunch of movies for sale. I'm serious. That dream screwed me up. And that's not easy. Check out my other donation for more deets. And also, this is some weird shit. Hotsma, what is this? What the fuck? What the fuck? Wow. Rouge got some bats. And they're jiggling. Wow. Is this on PC? It has to be. She's... She's... Oh, okay. Now that's just... That's just disturbing. Alright, we're no longer talking about, like, practicality. What the fuck is this? The boobs encompass her whole body. Wow. Where did niggas find this video? Hatsuma! The fact that you have this? I thought this was a game for kids. The, the chow is literally being like... What do you call a tit fuck in, in Japanese? What's it? How do you call it again? What is it called? Crushing the child with your fucking boobs, Rouge. Wow. 
Why have I never seen this before? All right, this is just a pair of tits at this point. That's all that existed. Paizuri, there we go, Paizuri. She was Paizurying everything, bro. It's a walking pair of tits. That's all it is. And they're still moving. That's fucking crazy. Thank you for that, though, Hatsuma. It, it kind of... Um, yeah, this is time... Ugh, shit's not working. It's not working. Everything's failing. H hey, Jack Daniels says it's only HTTP. Oh, oh, oh. It said HTTPS. I don't know. I'm so bad at this. I fucking suck at this shit. Come on, give me something, bro. Hatsuma? Yeah, I know. I, I literally, I, I intentionally fucked his name up. I look away for a second and it's this. Yeah, that's, that's kind of the channel in general. Man, this shit is not working out, bro. This thing's getting slow, man. This deep web shit is hard to do when you don't have somebody to... I know, though, I know um, Hero Traps is trying to help me out, man. But, you know, it's, it's like, uh, I, I feel unprepared myself in general. I gotta... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna come back later, man. I, I gotta prepare more before I go into the deep web. This shit is not working out, bro. It's not working out. But thank you for sending me link, guys. I appreciate it. I'm gonna look at some of these in the email address after the stream is over. And I'm gonna try to pull it up myself after and see if everything works. I mean, I don't know. But then again, that kind of takes away from the first reaction standpoint of it. I literally have to go in there with someone who knows if links work or not. I have to have a way to copy-paste accurately. And these links are way too long. These shits be taking, like... Half a year to write down. But for now, I think the stream is pretty much done. It's late. I know you guys got stuff to do in the morning. And today was already a fail because of Kahoot. I really was bummed after that Kahoot thing. So if I seem a little bit out of it at this point, it's it's the Kahoot. Yeah, when things don't work out, it's like that. But you know, we're gonna we have people who sent me a bunch of alternatives on my email. So I mean it's that's to me, that works out. We'll find something that works. Sorry the Kahoot didn't work out sponsors. You see, they're all pissed. The niggas are posting the Kahoot email, like, what the fuck? Dr. Don Von Doom says, Edda, guys, send this to you before on stream to watch it. You almost did, but you were wasted, but don't worry. It doesn't show real human nudity. It's weird and slightly disturbing. Okay, well, fuck it. Human-sized Muppet porn. It's a 11-minute video, so I don't know how much longer I can watch this shit. But, I'll check it out. E-bombs world! Human-sized Muppet porn. So we're talking Muppets fucking and sucking? Alright, let's give it a little time. People said, get out, my nigga. Banned? What do you mean, banned? Is this wrong? Everyone seems like they know what this is. Didn't we already see this? I didn't see this yet. This is the first time. What the fuck are you getting yourself into, Etika? I don't know what this is. I've never seen this before. It's Muppets. What could this be? Everyone seems like they know what this is already. I'm confused. Man, I'm deleting this website as soon as possible. Sam Jones, Chris Longoria. Vintra i skogen utan för killen är stränga. Träden klagar. Äckorna slutar leka. Well, before I end the stream after watching this, um, Chris Longoria, Sam Jones, Magma Gamer, Jordan, um, Jack Daniels. Spiral Moria. It is without the HTTP. It's only HTTP. I put that. It didn't work. Or maybe that's a J. You know, I already closed it though. Um, Sam Jones, Lucas Wrangle, Abandoned Vlogs, Ice Cake Fifty One, Xavier Lopez, Blazing Yay. Ice, Spiral Mo again, Dillion Taco, Acorns to Earth, Acorns. Thank you very much for that donation. Tortoise Ducks, Ahmad, Juan, Juan. Dylan, Drink for Weep, Counter, Looney Boy, all these motherfuckers that hit me up. Thank you for the Fåglar nations sjunger inte. Och ensamheten gör som man känner kylan än mer. Hey, Lemzy Zest. Hey, on, I've been working since the dawn of time. I want to hit you with some quick sketching fan art. Och den tror sig störa mig med sitt svaga sken. What the fuck? Lemzy Zest? I remember that name. What is this? 
Hold on a second. Hold on. We got to pause this for a minute. Hold on. Dr. Dom. This motherfucker just donated and sent a fucking real ass image. This is a Red Robin, bro. This shit is sick. <laughs> this is actually really well done. God damn. Wherever, if you had a Twitter, I would follow you, bro. Like, this is actually really, really good art. Give, give Lemmy Zest some props. Motherfucker just donated to send me this image. And this is, wow, really high end. This looks like it's ripped straight out of a dojin or something. You got the Red Robin with the swimsuit on. I see you out here, my boy. Damn, I, I'm feeling all kinds of weeaboo right now. This shit is cool. This is real. That's, that's, nigga, that's a fucking save. That's a fucking save right there. Nigga, that's a save. Throw that bitch in the motherfucking desktop. Thank you very much, Lemmy. Wow, man. So you donate to me $20. You give me that. Thank you. You send me fan art. That's another thing that you did for me. And then you send me love on top of it all. So you took time out of your day, money out of your day, and man hours out of your day. All for me. That's a lot of a contribution. That's a huge contribution at one time. Did you Do you feel like it's a huge contribution? Or do you feel like, oh, I'm just, it's whatever. If you feel like it's whatever, then that just shows that you're passionate about the shit. And you did it for me. And you didn't even think twice about it. Thank you. Thank you. Legitimately. I appreciate all of the man hours, the effort, the time that went into that. I know. I can never do that. Come on, fucking draw something that beautiful. What am I looking at here? Doctor. What happened to Dr. Robert Hoffman? I miss him, man. Why are people worried about this? What is this going to show us? Counter Genesis Productions saying, Hey, Etika, it's because of you and a few others that I'm thinking about making a living off of you two. Uh, thanks a bunch. But anyways, please check this out. Hey, man, listen. Now's not the time to make a living off of YouTube. The ad revenue is so fucking bad. I mean... You would have to have some insane videos with a bunch of views and demographics to be able to pull off a successful income. I'm telling you right now, the ad revenue is ass. And I am I have benefits. I have benefits of not having any um, of that re waiting review or having a video stop. Oh, not eligible for monetization. All my videos get monetized because of the benefits I have with broadband. But I, mean, I don't know. Maybe it'll be better for you. My perspective is limited. I hope you're successful what is this I'm looking at? Oh lord. What is this? Good. Uh... Master Rosie. Deathdate.info. Oh. What is going on in this show? Like, are they people? Just skip forward. What the fuck? Death date. When will you die? I remember this from way back. Dr. Dom says, Don't worry, it doesn't show real human nudity, but it's weird and slightly disturbing. Is this really okay to show? It's not people. What the fuck? I have to delete this stream as soon as we're done here. It's not real people though. This is some Roblox Minecraft type shit. What the fuck? No. Um, we, we, we gotta delete the stream ASAP. ASAP. She looks like a thumb. She legit looks like a thumb. These motherfuckers are a cloth fucking. There's no loot there. What the f- What the fuck is that thing? Does that make us furries? I think we're all furries now. She's happy. <laughs> I got some dick. <laughs> mm. 
What is this, bro? Dom, I'm questioning why you have a link like this in the first place. You're scaring my viewers away. Well, we're all gonna go to sleep tonight. She's getting down. Yo, this is too much, man. I don't know. Like, this, I'm feeling really weird right now. I am not hard. I am soft as Sally, bro. I'm feeling real uncomfortable. And we had a nigga peeping in the window, looking crazy. Bro, I can't watch any more of this shit. Let's fast forward. What the fuck? Again? No, no, no. I can't watch any more of this fucking shit. The Don't tell me she fucks the... Well, that was the most uncomfortable way that I've ever ended a stream. I think that if I fill out this death date thing, thanks to what we just watched, I feel like this is going to be tomorrow. My name is... <laughs> Let me make sure my thing personal pops up. Desmond Amofa. Your birth dates. All right. It is May... Wait, no, no. The day is the 12th. May 1990. I am a male. Height, 6 foot 6 inches. Weight, I weigh 215 pounds, 98 kilograms. Do I am um, stimulants? I take alcohol. I take drugs on a rare occasion. Uh, what's it going to do? Is it going to figure out when I die? Wait a minute, it says I'm going to die. Time left, 20 years, 6 months, and 6 days? I'm going to die that soon? How did it predict that so soon? Why is that so soon? 2038 is right around the corner. Nigga just admitted to using... I mean, I don't... I, I've done one, one or two drugs before in my life, like weed. Do I do drugs on a regular occasion? No, I may be hitting those checkpoints because it doesn't ask, oh, how often do you use these things? It, it asks you, oh, do you use, did you ever use a drug? Did you, it just says stimulants. Did you ever take an alcohol? Yes. Did you ever take a drug? Yes. It's like, oh, you're going to die in 2038. <laughs> well, guys, I don't have that much time left. Damn. But you know, there's a better website for this that actually goes into more detail. It's called Death Clock. And that website actually asks you information pertaining to the amount of stuff that you take, not just like, you know, you taking the stuff. Let me make sure nothing personal pops up. All right, so day of birth. I was born on the 12th. This website is way more detailed. I was born in May. Um, let me, let me, I, I have to upgrade you, bro. Your website's a little bit out of order. 1990, sex, I'm male. Mode. Now, here we go. Now it asks you more. You see, it asks you what your mode is. I'm an optimist, of course. My body mass index to determine your index into your height and weight below. Now, if you put in your height, I'm six foot six inches. Your body mass index is a huge indicator for how long you're going to live. And if it stays at a really bad number, then you're fucked. I, uh, I am six foot six inches at 215 pounds. Check it. My body mass index is 25. So I'm going to put that in 25 and I'm not a smoker. Check your death clock. It says right here. I am going to die April 26, 2088. So I don't know. Compare that to the results that I got before. It says April 19th, 2038. So it's funny how they both came up to the um, same month, but just completely different years. 2088, April 26th, or 2038, April 19th. I don't know which one would I go for. Obviously, 
This one. I mean, I don't want to die in 20 fucking 38, nigga. These are all the seconds I have left to live. That shit is crazy. The fact that it actually is counting it down, bro. That's when my life is going to end, dog. I, I feel like Good. this one's way more believable as long as I don't get shot in the head or something. Dr. Dom saying, honestly, I didn't expect you to get that far. It wasn't supposed to be. <laughs> yeah, I know it wasn't supposed to be more. I was joking around with you, bro. I just josh around with niggas. You know I do, right? I, I, I like playing games. He says, I didn't expect you to get that far. It wasn't supposed to be boner inspiring, but give your dick nightmares instead. Since it's almost Halloween and all. Sorry if it was too much. I'm drunk, my boy. I'm drunk as fuck too, bro. Don't worry about it. It's no big deal, man. It's all for the laughs at the end of the day. Trust me. Niggas ain't taking it. No, niggas ain't sweating. It was funny, man. Thank you for sending that to us um, and disturbing the fuck out of us. I'm going to have nightmares thanks to you. Appreciate it, bro. You know what? To be able to have nightmares now that I've seen so many horror movies and flicks and I feel so unaffected when it comes to scary stuff, I appreciate when a nigga can disturb the fuck out of me. It's refreshing. But all right, boys. With that in mind, you all know the date of my death. It's going to come through eventually. You know, but hey, I could—I I wish I could leave the window open and just like watch the seconds tick throughout my entire life. Imagine you watch it and I'm an old man in 2088. 90, I think I'll be 98 years old in 2088 because I'm 27 in 2017. So in... 19 Good. in 2088 i would be 98 years old yeah wow april i would be ready to turn 99 years old will i live to be 98 years old or will i die earlier than that damn this is kind of deep bro if i was alive at that point i would go back to the website and be like oh man this is my time i lived a good life <laughs> dad dudes i'm gonna be an old man you're all going to be old men with me. 2088, you're not going to be young either. Think about it. That's a year where every single person in the stream right now will be aged. Just completely irrelevant. <laughs> irrelevant Ricegum status to the actual young people that come in. Isn't that crazy to you? You could be 16, 12 years old right now. In all those years, you'll be the same as me. An old person. We'll all be equal at that time. <laughs> That's crazy. What a thought. Um, unless you're watching this stream while you're zero years old. But even then, 2088, bro. That's in like, that's in like, what? Over 60 years, 70 years, 80 years? 80 years, bro. Even if you're zero years old watching this, you're going to be old by the time 2088 comes around. Fuck my life. Fuck your life. It's over. <sighs> so you mean to tell me that when I'm that old man, I'm going to be like, oh, this was a good one. Dun, 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 dun. In New York, I'm Millie Rock. Hide it in my soul. My back. <laughs> That's how it's going to be. The oldies are going to be Magnolia. <laughs> Hide it in my sock. Hide it in my sock. Hey. Hit it from the back. Watch a nigga bless you. <laughs> That's so good. crazy. That's crazy to me. <laughs> Crying in my arms like a nigga erected. Talk about a broken heart running to the restroom. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think I've. I, this is insane. That's a crazy theory to me because it's actually true. We're not going to be singing the oldies that the adults are now. We're going to be singing these oldies. Wow. Did you ever stop and think about that, bro? It's insane to me to think about that. I remember. When I was 14 years old saying, God damn, 20 sounds like so long. I'm almost 30. Trust me, it may seem like a long time from now, but you will age and it will creep up on you. Embrace everything that you have with your youth now because it won't last. I mean, I know I don't look it, but damn, I am truly an advocate for that. 30s crept up on me out of nowhere. I was just a teenager and now... Huh. I'm getting close to a midlife crisis. I'll see you guys later on. Thank you for entertaining me. Um, Lime says, well, let it go finish JoJo before death comes. Nani, what is JoJo? Will I remember that meme when I'm 80 years old? Years in the future, will I remember how much I delayed JoJo? Will I remember YouTube? Will I still be doing YouTube at 80 years old? An old man doing YouTube videos? When will you decide, eh, I'm tired of watching Etika. I'm going to move on. Will there be a time where I completely lose relevancy and I only get like 100 views per video? Will that ever happen? What does the future What does the future look like? 
will there be a time in your life and my life where we get tired of each other and we decide we're going to move on? It's so crazy to me to think about it like that. Wow. This is insane. And it will happen. I'm 30 now. Well, I'm not 30. I'm, I'm 27. But I mean, you know, I'm, 27 is super close to 30 years old, right? It's right there. It's right there. I mean, I wonder. Can't help but wonder. Where will we be in 50 years? This is some deep shit. Maybe you dudes don't like thinking about it. I, I think it's interesting to think about. Like, you know, just to daydream and fathom about the thoughts of you know oh what could happen you know that's a lot of time and it will happen it will pass that time will come you'll stop and be like holy shit crazy 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 damn you know what's crazy you know what's even crazier there's a lot of you dudes in the chat right now a lot of you watching my stream at this current moment october 13th 2017, 2.40 on the East Coast, a.m. in the morning. In that Good. year that we saw, there will be so many of us right now that are going to be dead. <laughs> That's crazy. So many of you guys are going to be dead in a <laughs> before the year 2088. God, this, this is so insane. I can't process this. It's, it's interesting to me, though, because, you know, it just shows how life comes and goes. You'll be dead, but you'll have children, and they'll have legacies and lives. Dude, when will we be forgotten as our generation? There will be a generation that just completely doesn't know about us. Like our children, they'll be there in like the year 3000. They'll be doing their thing, wilding out. Because the thing is, we're doing the same thing. We're living in the modern age of 2017 and shit. We're having fun and all that. Do you think I remember or know about my great grandfather or his great great grandfather? No, they become forgotten. They're gone. Let my friends, let us make sure that we write our names in the history books. So that way, the contributions that we give towards this planet to make it better for those who come after us are truly remembered. We have to make sure we leave a dent somewhere. I know for a fact I'm gonna try to leave my dent and I hope you as my audience don't hesitate to do the same thing. Don't bitch out on me. Let's make dents in the world together. And I ain't talking Logan Paul. I'm talking some real shit, real nigga Joy-Con shit. Help me make a dent. Let's all be remembered in this bitch, all right? Fuck, man. Hatsuma saying, so you appreciate people who can creep you out, weird you out. All right. I think this kid is getting something. And Lime, and we had Andreas SSG who said, hey, Etika, made a Joy-Con Boys and Girls logo on Twitter. Um, my name is Sark. Sark. Just add it at me. Add it at me in my notifications and I'll see it. Maybe you did it already. Maybe you did it already. I made a Joy-Con Boys and Girls logo. And I'm back at it again with the fan art. Hold up. Hey, I see you, my boys. Looking kind of clean. I like it. I like it. Jesus. My nigga got the two. He my motherfucker got the got the shadow edit. Is that the dark edit of my boy? Fuck. I was looking for that other man too. <laughs> Damn, I really wish I was able to do that Kahoot. I had some special prizes in store. I had some special shit in store, but you know what? It's whatever. All right, boys. I, I'm not here to get philosophical and talk about the future with you guys. I'm going to let y'all go to sleep. Motherfucking talking about 2088. Y'all motherfuckers got shit to do tomorrow morning. So for now, I'm going to be out of here. Andreas, Lime, Hatsma, um, Dr. Dom, Counter Genesis Productions. Thank you. Wait, he says, can you watch the video I sent in my past donation? It's funny. Counter Genesis? Let me see. Where's your past? He said etiquette because of... Okay, here we go. Let me see. Here. What is this? Oh, oh Reggie, yeah. Okay. You know what? Let's see. Let's see. What Reggie, please. I can't fucking take this. Oh, what God. is this, Reggie? Of course, niggas send me memes and shit. This is, I don't think, oh, 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 oh. here we go, here we fucking go, here we fucking go. Oh. <laughs> Twenty fifteen. Jesus Christ. Twenty fifteen was so long ago. God damn, it's almost three years ago. Holy shit! Niggas didn't 
think it was possible. There's so many people that said, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get out of this. Counter, thank you for the meme. I appreciate it. It's, um. <laughs> Hopefully it made somebody laugh. I'm so used to seeing myself parody that it has to be really different. The way Double A did it, now that was that was crazy. But you know, it was good. It was good. It was good. All right, guys, I'm out of here. I'll see you dudes later on. Sorry, today's stream failed a little bit. It failed a lot. Cause fucking Kahoot. Fuck Kahoot, man. Damn it, Kahoot. Threw my damn mood off. But hey, next time we'll have more stuff prepared. I will see you guys later on, though. Take care of yourselves. Please do. Thank you for the contributions once again. Um, I don't know when I'll next stream, but we'll see. It'll happen. You know one thing I haven't done in a while is raid somebody. Is there anyone that we can raid right now? I'm tired, man. Like, my fucking sleep schedule. Good. I'm supposed to be sleeping by now. James the Savior. He says, Yeah, well, we'll all be old as fuck unless you're he Heihachi Mishima, who's old as fuck. But he looks like he's still in his physical prime, even as, even as an old man. Yeah, Heiachi is apparently hundreds of years old. The dude is like, he, but he's still fit as hell. I know, it's a little bit weird, right? He's not supposed to look like that at that age. I don't know, man. Hopefully, we can all have the Heiachi treatment. And not only is he old and he looks good, but the nigga can beat the shit out of you as an old man. So, hey, dog, I know this ain't Tekken, but... Maybe there's enough physical training. We can all bypass our physical limits and uh, the age gate. But, all right, the only person that's streaming is Ice Beside, and we already raided that nigga. Thank oh, you dude. very much, James. That's what I need it's to do, because this shit's going to Oh, he's again. in the um, Lexor. The Lexor this is going to fucking scuff. And we're Damn, all of his audience went to sleep, too. He only has 3,000 people watching him. My boys went to sleep, too, though. We only have 6,000 people watching us, so. Yeah, man, we're, 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 I'm about to sleep. It's late. Uh, I don't think there's anybody else to raid. I mean, we can go to Twitch. Twitch.tv slash who the fuck is streaming this late at night. Mm, we have more viewers than Josh OG. That just goes to show you that it's late. Motherfuckers are knocked out right now. Mango streaming. Um, chilling dude streaming. TK Breezy. Life with laughs. Man, I haven't been on Twitch in a fucking long time. Terms, uh, I already rated all these motherfuckers. I haven't watched anybody's streams. I don't watch anybody's streams anymore. Jesus Christ, man. Why am I such a horrible Good. content creator supporter? I, I mean, I support other motherfuckers, but just nowadays I'm so busy it's hard to find new people to watch. Shuji coming through saying, here's a last donation from me to you. I drew you something too. Hey, Shuji, thank you, man. I really do appreciate the time you spent on this, whatever it may be. Hey, hold on. Isn't this that witch from, um, what the hell is this witch's name? The one that has the massive, um, the massive hat? I remember seeing a lot of footage about this character. Uh, I actually have some stuff in the Spank Bang from her, to be honest with you, but she was good. Thank you, Shuji. How long did it take you to sketch that out, my man? Well, you know what? It's better than anything that I could ever do, so, you know, I gotta give it props. Fucking Christ, man. Keep it up. I think the thing is, is that you, um, you, you get so easily discouraged sometimes when you feel like, oh, it's not good enough. I mean, a lot of us have told ourselves, eh, why even bother? We're bad. But a lot of the time, talent can be outworked by just effort. Anyways, no more philosophical shit. I'm going to go play some Shantae, um, go on 4chan for a little bit, and I will see you guys later on. This Shantae shit is good, bro. I've been playing the hell out of it lately. I mean, I don't know. It's it, it, it just has a certain appeal to it. I'm not just talking about the um, you know, the obvious belly dancing and all those. I mean, you know, she's nice to look at, but the game has great music. So I'm gonna go enjoy this. I'm gonna see you guys later on, though. All right. Peace out, dudes. Later. Thank you so much for everything tonight. Thank you so much. Like, fuck. Hold on a second before we go, Hero Traps came through again. He said, 
Um, this is my last donation, totaling a hundred dollars. You donated a lot tonight, bro. I, I just, you know, I, I, I hope you didn't get offended by what I said last time. It's just I wasn't in the mood to call anybody or whatever. You know, it was just supposed to be a quick on and off thing. If I do a dedicated deep web stream, that I'll pro that'll probably be the time where you know I take calls from people or interact with them on certain levels. But not for tonight. It was supposed to be a you know a dip in, dip out. That was all. But hopefully you understand that, man. Um, thank you for the contributions, man. A hundred dollars is definitely nothing to laugh at. Um, thank you so much to all, everyone who donates tonight. You know, Acorn included, like fucking two hundred. Fuck. He says, anyways, I hope you can watch this before you log off. This is some good shit. I'm gonna trust you on that one, hero. I, I don't you. like inter. Oh no, this is the video you sent me before. All right, this is a you laugh, you lose challenge. I'll entertain it. Internet memes, SpongeBob. If you did like internet memes, then you should subscribe to That Is The Plan, the best meme channel on YouTube for the memes. I can already tell you that I'm not gonna laugh at anything in this video. Stop! Is mayonnaise a meme? <laughs> you laugh, you lose blood. I don't think this is going to be a challenge in the slightest. What's up, my React bros? Reethany Actano here, the internet's most reactionary internet oh. man, YouTube man. And isn't my dental game on fleek? You guys know, it's lit. Zip, 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 zip. Today is a special episode of the Reaction Dude, Are you channel, dudes going to laugh at this nigga? I'm going to be actually doing a little bit of a you laugh, you lose, I lose. I mean, really, technically, we all lose because Get to I'm the point. That is, I'm just this nigga took forever to get to the point, bro. I didn't even finish reading it when it made me laugh. Senpai, will you notice me? Senpai will never notice you. But laugh. <laughs> Hero Traps, you're cool peoples, man. And I do appreciate the donations, but child's play. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Hey, hold on. My man Hatsuma came back through with one more donation, man. He said, be safe, my man. Hashtag off camera boys. Thanks a lot, Hatsuma. I'll see your ass later on, bro. Thank you. You, you donated a lot tonight, too, bro. You were going in for me. Thank you. I'm going to keep butchering your name for years to come. I'm look, I look forward to it. Shit. Hey, my man Inquisitor Fail, what's up, bro? He says, um, got home just in time for the end of the stream. It's always good to see you up and at it. Enjoy your time with Shantae. And also, totally off topic, you ever pick up Titanfall 2? Have a good night. Titanfall 2. Uh, I wish I was able to get into it like I was for the first game. Unfortunately, it just didn't really hit me. And on top of it, I didn't really have an opportunity when I was in the middle of moving and stuff. I know it's a good game. I just didn't really have the chance to jump in head first, but I don't want to give any false promises. I probably will never touch it again, but I mean, or never if you can get a chance to, but I would like to. Hopefully, I'll be in a position where I can just, you know, play around with it. But there'll probably be a bunch of other shooters. The thing that makes it crazy is there's so many good games that come out. You know, there's so many shooters out there. Like, I, I play Splatoon all the time, and it's like Titanfall 2. I guess it lost its moment in the sun. So maybe it's already done. But if there's a three, I'll definitely jump into that one. Thanks a lot, though, Inquisitor. I'll see you later, though, bro. Sorry you couldn't be here for the whole thing. But then again, everything failed today, so fuck my life. <laughs> 